In this video, I will be opening 200 of Yu-Gi-Oh's rarest packs ever. These range from the newest set, Wild Survivors, all the way back to Yu-Gi-Oh's very first set, LOB First Edition. And we'll also see a booster box worth of Retro Pack 2 along the way. This set could contain the legendary Blue Eyes Shining Dragon. Oh, and a quick note about that LOB First Edition pack, it's heavy, so we should pull a foil in today's video. Thanks again for 200K, and sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. What is up, guys? Welcome to the finale of the 200K special. We've already opened an Invasion of Chaos First Edition box. Go check out that video. That was insane. We also did a live stream all the way to 200K subscribers. If you missed that one, you can go check that out. We opened some pretty awesome stuff. Haven't actually done it yet because, you know, we're recording this right before. So, you know, a little spoiler, but no big deal. Go check it out if you guys are interested in that. But we have an epic opening today. Before we actually hop into this insane opening video, I have an insane giveaway. And by I, I mean one of my Patreons, which you guys have seen at the end of most every video, Ian is giving away this Toon Summon Skull PSA 10. He wanted to support the channel, so he picked up this Toon P Summon Skull PSA 10 from me and said, give it away in your 200K special video. So one of you guys will win this PSA 10 MRL first edition Toon Summon Skull. All you have to do is like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, let me know your favorite pack that you see in this video or something about the last 200K subscribers, you know, everything we've done over the years, what was your favorite moment, something like that. And huge shout out to Sassy Auto for sponsoring this over opening make sure you go check out Sassiato's links down below he sponsored all of our 200k specials so make sure to go check him out pick up anything you want with my link down below it also supports me so it's like a double whammy for me which is really awesome so shout out to sassy for allowing us to do these really awesome openings he is a legend and i'm really excited for his store to open coming soon so i'll keep you guys updated about that all right guys let's not delay any longer i've already stopped this recording once because somebody was mowing outside but you know what <laughs> who cares let's just get right into a 200k special i have a heavy first edition lob back you guys saw all that retro pack two let's start off with wild survivors let's pull the burger you know it took us six cases to pull this guy so we might as well pull it in the very first pack this is going to be a very very long video so sit back relax enjoy the content also thank you guys so much for 200k subscribers this has been a pretty awesome run we got a super rare right off the bat so starting off slow but that's okay this is just wild survivors okay our last two dino cards no big deal right there we're gonna have a lot of different packs here today i'm not necessarily going in order but i am gonna start with the newer packs and then kind of make our way towards the end we do have 24 retro pack too which is a full booster box worth so probably not gonna do all of those in a row we'll probably mix them in but I'm already excited to open those because we know they are unscaled based on our whatnot streams. We pulled like a Jinzo, and then on my video, I think I pulled something too. Trap Jammer starting it off with a super already. Very nice IOC, a non-guaranteed super, by the way. I think we're going to be doing a counter on the screen, which is going to show how much money we make, not make because it's not profit because I obviously had to buy all these packs. I just want to see how much we pull total. So, you know, money cards added up is what's going to be at the end. And in the, you know, when we did this before, I think with the every pack opening and it wasn't that great because the pulls are a little iffy because you only have one of every pack. I feel much more confident about this opening because there's like multiples of some packs. I know a lot of them are unweighed, like probably almost all of them, but you know, some of them you're not really sure. Some of the champion packs and stuff that we're going to open, but uh, a lot of it, I know they're unweighed. So we have a really good chance to pull awesome cards do you guys remember when i said someone was mowing now they're weed eating but that's a little bit quieter so i guess that's a i guess that's a good thing whatever you know we're gonna do th i think it's four on darkwing blast so i'm gonna do three let's see if we can get a starlight out of darkwing blast we never got the uh blackwing dragon starlight that'd be pretty cool to get that right now cucumber horse pretty cool card we got oh a valence awakening solo activation so yeah valence not a great card but an ultra rare i mean not even supers are guaranteed in well actually yeah they are never mind so this is basically a super rare what am i talking about okay good stuff in there let's open a i have a nice variety of newer but a lot more of the old dm stuff we probably have over 50 packs of that so if you count retro back it's like 75 chaos impact first edition this i grabbed a few of because of the legendary ip mascarena and you guys know what that card has meant to us in the past with some amazing double masquerade of starlight pulls luna let's just pull another one right here we have salamand great i take any starlight to be honest if we get a starlight in this opening it's gonna be really awesome dream mirror phantasm and uh, we will not be getting one in that pack all right let's do a little movie pack secret edition so there's no real rhyme or reason to what packs i picked i just tried to pick really cool packs that'd be fun to open so uh, i do like these up oh, slide for the sky dragon sacred rare deep eyes white dragon already looking nice for adding value B berry magician might be over a dollar too and then a crimson nova like three of those I think will add to our value. Also, I'm hoping to get some gradable cards today because we are a little bit low on our cards to get graded. You know, I have a few that I really want to grade, like uh, 
BLS from the uh, IOC opening, you know, stuff like that. I don't know if you guys have seen my LOB opening yet, so I'm not going to say anything about that because I don't really know when this is going to come out. It kind of depends on two, when we hit 200k. There's a super rare that's not actually guaranteed. Very nice. So I don't want to spoil anything for you guys. Future videos. Let's do this one. So we have a duelist pack Yugi, which is a fun pack, but everybody knows Yugi got done dirty here. There's no ultimate rares in the set, unlike duelist pack Kaiba, which is pretty sad. So we're really just looking for Mirror Force, Dark Paladin, Dark Magician Girl, stuff like that. And we didn't get it. We got Light Force Sword and Monster Reborn. I have a pretty wide variety. We've got some random packs, like five cards. We've got some big, uh, you know, 13 card packs. And we've got some, a lot of regular nine card packs in here. All right. And you know, I had to throw in a couple of ghosts from the past one, because if we do pull the Dark Magician, I mean, that could be our best pull of the video. Like even with LOB first, like it's a $600 card. So you never know. We have Retrograde. We have Sun Avalon Dryas, Dragonity, and we have a Hieratic Seal of Creation just an ultra rare okay guys i think it's time to open something a little bit older so we have legacy of the valiant this is not like an insane set but it is first edition it can contain ultimate rares and ghost rares which is why i wanted to throw in a lot of these exile sets because they are pretty fun to open they have a lot of potential for like cool high rarity cards so i did get about 10 of several of these different sets. We have like Photon Shockwave, which is a pretty nice one. That might not be Zexel though. It's a little bit newer. We have Ghost Rick. I'm not exactly sure because I've never seen Zexel. We have Automata Para. Oh, and a number C101. Silent Honor Dark. This has an ultimate rare print, which is a super sick card, but this is a really, is this the cover card? Okay, we're starting it off hot, guys. Cover card already pulled. That's a great start. I'm loving that. All right, time to do the Dark Crisis 25th anniversary. I had to throw in like a mini box of 25th anniversary. I can't help it, guys. I also have four uh, blisters of Labyrinth of Nightmare that I'm hoping I won't forget. They're sitting right there, but the, I didn't want to open the blisters off camera. It just feels like, I mean, we're opening it anyway, but it feels like a waste. You know what I mean? Because the blisters shouldn't be open. Let's be honest. Okay, I think I got something here. Oh, we did! A Chinato, King of the Higher Plane! This is one of my favorite Dark Crisis cards. That's awesome. This is a great start to this opening. I'm loving it so far. It's always worrisome when you open a bunch of loose packs, you know, that you won't get anything. So, especially like those every pack openings. I mean, the pulls were, like, we had some good pulls, but it's hard to really get a lot of awesome pulls out of a bunch of loose packs. So, starting off well here, and I feel like we this is our best chance out of any huge loose opening we've ever done, because... I've kind of like vetted a lot of these. We have Decision Battle, Donner Dragon for Hire, or Dagger, not Dragger. Did I say Dragger? No, not, not, not that. All right, guys, we had to throw in Legendary Collection too, okay? We had to throw it in because it's one of our favorite sets to open. There's some really good value in here, so this is gonna help our opening, you know, get some good cards. We have Destiny or Fearmonger. We gotta change your Reflector Ray. Evil Hero Lightning Golem, super rare. Here comes the Secret or Ultra, I can't remember. Wing Karibo level nine, that's a beautiful card. And Elemental Hero Chaos neos that's a good one we got steam healer that that might be money too and then grand mole is also a great common our stack of good pulls is already adding up here's a set that you're like what shadow specters made it to the top 200 packs i'm not top 200 but in our 200 packs yes because i love this ghost rare and ultimate rare. i think it's really fun it's also first edition it's also got a chance at the ultimate rares and stuff like that as i said before we got drew drew battle boxer so yeah we don't have all the best like cards here's farfus cat we got chow chow chan like not every pack here is like one of the best packs ever but it's a good variety if you know what i mean we have a malice severus knife so a little knife action i do love malice severus knife that's a cool card okay time for a little galactic overlord at some point like in this opening like probably halfway through we're just gonna be opening like banger after banger not that these aren't these are just kind of like middle of the road like fun stuff but we got Lady of D. Very nice. We got the Doom Donuts. I got to put the Lady of D to side. That's hilarious. Influence Dragon. We Insector Ladybug. Hieratic Sun Dragon. Uh, Hieratic Seal of the Sun Dragon Overlord. There we go. Nimble Manta. We have Final Insection. Can we get a Ghost Rare out of here? No, we cannot. We have Return. He wants to return something and get his money back. Okay, this is our only other Ghost of the Past one pack. So let's see if we can pull that Dark Magician. It'd be fun to start off with a Ghost Rare Dark Magician, right? That'd be pretty cool. Let's just pull every rarity in this video. Why not? Starlight Ghost, let's just make it happen. Dragoonity, we have Hieratic Dragon of Aset and a Raid Raptor Tribute Lanius. So no Ghost Rare out of Ghost from the Past one. All right, let's do a Cosmo Blazer. This set isn't amazing, but the cover card is really, really nice. The Heart Earth Dragon or whatever it's called. Let's see if we can do it. Let's pull something awesome. One, two, three. We got a damage card in the back. You guys see that? It's probably going to happen a few times with all these different varieties and years and loose packs and garbage ogre. Nice. We have the Hazy Pillar, Brother of the Firefist Raven, After the Storm, da -da -da -bot. the Brush Fire Knight, and we have a Dimension Gate. I thought that was a much older card. Apparently not. That is actually a Zexel card. A lot newer than I thought. All right, everyone. The time has come. 
for a first retro pack two pack. We have 24 of them, so we might as well open one now. Don't worry, there's plenty left. I wanna sprinkle these throughout the video. Look how far over these tabs are, it's kinda weird. These are certainly unweighed. We've pulled Jinzo, Injection Fairy Lily, and a couple supers out of these so far. So we do have a chance at secret rares, and you know the secret rare we want. That is not a great start. The Spirit Message L, oh no. That is not what we want to see. I don't know if it's three or four. I'm going to do three to be safe. We have once before pulled the blue eyes shining dragon, and I would love to do it again. We did it at 20K subscribers. Let's see if we can do it at 200 as well. Be kind of a, kind of poetic there. We have Gravekeeper's Chief, Magic Drain. We have the Emergency Provisions. There's a lot of other great secrets as well if we could get those. The L is not a good sign. Pulling a Spirit Message L in this big opening. I don't like to see that. L's in the chat, AKA the comments right now. Gravekeeper Spy, let me know. Will we be able to overcome the L? Light Force Sword. I feel I feel like we pulled an L and pulled a Jinzo one time though. Here we go. Oh, it's a Gamma the Magnaware. So it is four from the back, unless it changes. Okay, Gamma the Magnaware. Okay, good. Co oh, it's not that good. Let's be honest. All right, starting it off with a dud in Retro Pack 2. But there's a lot of packs to go. So you got to believe, guys. We can pull something good. Chaos Impact. We've opened one of these already. Nothing in that one. We have a Soul Levy. Let's see if we can get something crazy. Desert Locust. I'm going to be checking that we're recording a lot in this video. Hopefully we do not... Oh, that's like a, it's a five from the back action. Okay, there's a super rare. Interesting, I didn't realize that. We got a Chaos Impact. Let's do another Legacy of the Valiant. We already pulled the cover card in Ultra. Let's pull the cover card in the Ultimate Rare as well, or pull the Ghost, I'd be down for that. What is this one? Is it Mobius? I think it's Mobius. I don't think I've ever pulled that one. That would be good to add to my pulling every Ghost Rare goal. I do not have this one yet. Purge, Ghost Rick Yeti. We have the Kalantosa, Chronomaly. I don't care what Ghost it is. If we pull a Ghost, I'm gonna be happy today. We have a Monarch to awaken because this is the first time i haven't done gold series haunted mine which is like a guaranteed ghost so hopefully we'll just get a random one today all right pharaoh servant as rhyme style says it's not a ruxin video without a Jinzo pull so we have a chance out of this pharaoh servant we also have uh you know retro pack two we can pull the ultra we have mr volcano we have the eye of truth let's see if we can live up to rhyme styles expectations here we have ground collapse we have vampire baby and oh, okay it's a super limited removal it will pump up those machines so i guess that's jinzo-esque a little bit nice super rare been a while since we pulled something so we'll take that now let's open this dragons of legend 2 this would be incredible if it had a tomb kingdom inside this does have an ultimate rare print now but the secret rare print i mean it just looks incredible so this is the original tomb kingdom print i don't know what kind of pack trick this is i'm just gonna go from the front tune roll back I'm guessing it's in the back. We have Prediction Princess 2 rollback. Maybe that's a good sign. We're rolling back to when we pulled this before a long time ago. And Prediction Princess. Tara Trey. Okay, I don't know if that's how you say that, but that is not the Toon Kingdom. Okay, we have not done a Photon Shockwave yet. Here is a card I've never pulled, the Galaxy Has Photon Dragon, unless you count when I pulled the Unlimited out of the Mystery Pack Extra cards. That was pretty amazing. But it wasn't on video, unfortunately. So you guys have never seen that. We got to redeem ourselves by pulling a first dead ghost rare right here. We have Prior of the Ice Barrier, Sound the Retreat, Wind Up Warrior, Naturia Marin, Evo Miracle, the Ray Rider, Photon Lead. We have a Tribe, Shocking Virus, and a Light Serpent. That is a light looking foil. Like everything looked a little bit lighter. I was like, is this a foil? Light Serpent Super Rare out of Photon Shockwave. Okay. Foils are foils, we'll take those. Okay, let's do another movie pack secret edition. There's so many packs to open today. 200, in fact. Here we go, Metamorph Fortress, the Slifer again, okay. We have Pandemic, oh, don't, don't do that to us. Oh, and a Dark Magician secret, very nice. Dark Magician secret, Slifer secret, two Slifers in two packs, that's not bad for those. All right, we do have one maximum gold Eldorado. Let's see if we can pull an access code, maybe Dark Magician, Blue Eyes, something like that. We got a couple gold rares in here. Let's see what we can get. Scrap Dragon. We got Deep Sea Diva. That's a good card for Edison. Fire Formation Tinky just got a Collector Rare Print and a number IC1000. Okay, not too crazy there. I mean, whatever. Let's do another Legacy of the Valiant. We're kind of working on these front two like side rows I have here before we get too crazy on the back. So the back is going to be where it gets absolutely insane. We have Dodo -Do Buster, Ghost Trick Museum. By the way, get excited for that heavy LOB first edition back because, yeah, we could pull the blue eyes in this video. It would be insane. Gorgonic Golem, Gravekeeper Higher Attic, and a Gorgonic Cerberus. I mean, this would be perfect. A, a 200k special to pull the blue eyes. It would be awesome. And in theory, we could pull the blue eyes shining and the blue eyes. That'd be pretty cool as well. And how about a blue eyes ghost rare? What if we pulled, uh, if we pulled all three of those in one opening, it would probably be the greatest opening for Yu-Gi-Oh of all time. I mean, that would be insane. Here we go. Let's just do it right now. Last ghost from the past two. So our last chance, Pendulum Area. We have the agent. We have Savant Killer Pernicus. 
Vengeance and Fallen. So we're not, there's that dream. It's gone. No more Ghost Share, but that's okay. We can pull that later. Time for another Legendary Collection 2. You gotta believe, guys. We have Hero Counter Attack, Avian, Didi Crow, nice super rare. We got a U Bell, nice secret rare, and a Magical Mallet. That was a really good pack. A lot of those cards are worth a decent amount. I think U Bell is like a $10 secret rare. Very, very solid there. Hopefully, I'm not wrong. Because sometimes I say, that's like a $10 card, and then it pops up as like a $1 card. Happens sometimes. Okay. Shadow Specters. Only opened one of these so far. We have hope to get the Divine Dragonite, Felgrand, and Ulti or Ghost in this video. Ghost Rick Jangshi. We got Drew Drew. Empire Kingdom. The Ghost Rick Mansion. Mythical Tree Dragon. White Dragon. We have the Night Day. We have the Secret Sanctuary. And a Ghost Rick Witch. Okay, I have a couple of OCG packs here that I have never opened before. This is called Revival of Black Demon's Dragon. So I know that these are a lot harder to get foils out of. So if we do get anything, it's crazy. I think they have ultimate rares like OG. So if we pull something like that, it's going to be insane. I don't know where the pull tab is. So I'm just going to open it like, you know, old school, like from the bottom like this. Let's just do that. I don't know. There's probably a pull tab. Never opened this set before. We have a, what is this, leg hole or whatever he's called? All right, classic. We have Princess of Sarugi, or is that a different one? I feel like that is Princess of Sarugi. We have Kaminari Attack, we know that one. Okay, we got a lamp, and is that it? Or is there one more? Oh, it's Stone Ogre Grotto. So you don't even get rares guaranteed out of here. It's still really cool to see. Look, look how glossy these Japanese old school cards are. Really, really nice stuff. All right, let's open this Spell Ruler pack. Let's see what we can do. I'm gonna say all right and okay a lot today. I'm sorry, guys, because I'm, you know, I'm, I'm organizing as I go, and then I come back and I say, all right, okay. You know, it's my fault. Dark, Darth Maul, there we go. Not Dark Maul. We have Karate Man and a Liquid Beast. A liquid life form that thrives on water now's the time for duelist pad kaiba ultimate rare here we go let's get a throwback let's get that chaos ember dragon just like my very first pack returning we have soggy the dark clown he's a little soggy polarization we have judgment man and judgment man did i say judgment man what he's got a little, a little added a little mint on the end of his name i don't think we've opened galactic overlord yet so let's open one of these we have a few of these packs can we get that ghost rare i don't think i've pulled this ghost rare either there's a lot of ghosts i have not pulled so Hopefully we can pull at least one of them in this video. More than one, that'd be great. Sing Ceremony, we have Nomadic Force. Hieratic Dragon, we have Photon Papillar Operative, and uh, the wacky magic, that wacky magic, I should say. Let's return to Winged Dragon Raw Ghost Rare. Raw, hear our cry. Bring your non-scratch self to the surface. We have Token Sunday. Psychic Shockwave, we have Jinzo Jector, and uh, Egyptian God Slime. Now that is a good card. I think it's like 50 bucks for the Ultra. That is insane, that's getting a reprint at some point. But for now, that is a very expensive card. Let's do our first champion pack. So these, I got a whole box of these and I picked out like 10 of them. So we have another like 90, we're gonna open it another time. Actually it's 89 technically, because there was a light pack taken out. But these are definitely on wakes. They're from a sealed box. We could pull Lumina, super rare. It's like a $300 card, I think maybe even 400 so there's some big stuff i don't know where which way the okay it spoils it going that way so we got to open it backwards i hate when they do this come on konami why'd we do this back in the day i don't know the front might be the foil or the rare or the non-rare it might just be commons in here miraculously birth let's see can we get that lumina that's what we're really looking for ultra rare would be great too okay so it is a rare built burial from a different dimension it's not built from a different dimension but i guess you could say that i think it's time for a second retro pack too our second retro pack too, you know, retro pack, second pack. Here we go, okay. <laughs> Let's go. Let's see if we can pull that blue eyes shining. I mean, I've never pulled the Dragon Master Knight or the Harpy's Pet Dragon, so I'd be happy with both of those as well. It was four last time, so we're gonna do four. We have Bazoo the Soul Eater. We have Azura Priest. Emergency Provisions, Barrel Behind the Door, pretty good common. Dark Room of Nightmare, the Gillosaurus, special summon right there. Creature swap, and do we have a foil? No, it's one more. Light Force Sword. I've seen that a few times in this video. And Mage Power. Just a rare retro pack too. Over two to start. Back to some of our other packs like Legacy of the Valiant. We still have some big stuff. We have Asian English LOB to open today, which is gonna be fun. We might open one of those soon, actually. Because those those will be fun. Uh, you can get, I mean, Blue Eyes White Dragon could be pulled, so that'd be pretty awesome as well. Dark Artist, I do not remember this card, but this is very creepy. Chronomaly Moy Carrier, Majo Sheldon, we have, is that how you say that, Charge Man? Luminous, we have Purge Ray, I'm struggling to read today, so I could be wrong. Paladin of Photon Dragon, and uh, Xyz Avenger. These Exile Packs not coming in clutch so far. I guess technically we did get the cover card on one of them, so that's pretty good. The rest of them, though, are not doing so hot. Shadow Specters, here's your chance to turn it around. Ghost Rick Witch, we got Big Win. 
Soul Drain. We want a big win today. Let's go. Sacred Serpent, Bujingi Boar, White Dragon, Wyvern Buster, Battle and Boxer, Cheat Commission. No, no cheating. That's not fair. And a Vampire Grace. I remember that from Duel Links. Who would have thought? I know. Ruxin and Duel Links. Back to Darkwing Blast. A little bit newer. A little bit newer. I got this from a blister. So anything could happen. Can we get that? It's four, right? It is, right? Yeah, because no rares anymore. Can we get that Black Wing Dragon? Here we go. Godi Cosmos, War Chief. We have the Omen. We have Tier Laments, Baku. Oh, no Black Wing Dragon again. Time for Galactic Overlord. Here we go. The Lord of the Galactic. Will we pull a Ghost Rare right here? Morpho. Lady of D, a second one of those. I'm pulling those out. We got Falling. We have the Bouncer, Influence Dragon, Hieratic Dragon, and Light Ray, and Aqua Mirror Cycle. Okay, no foil. All right, guys, let's open this other Japanese pack I have. This is a Metal Raiders Japanese pack, which is really cool. You guys know I love Metal Raiders. It's really cool to see the original. You guys can see my poster back there on the other side. Yeah, definitely not crooked. That has uh, original OCG Metal Raiders artwork as well. That's green. I mean, I didn't know that until I got that poster. Really cool stuff. So I'm hoping we could pull something insane out of here. I mean, the sets are a little different in OCG. It's not like we can pull the same things, but they do have, I think, ultimate rares, probably different ones than like the ultras we have. All right, we have Tainted Wisdom. I, I always get this one and this might this might be Ancient Brain. The other one's Tainted Wisdom. I always get them confused. We have the Starboy. Dark Elf, a classic. We have Labyrinth Guard, right? Labyrinth Guard. And we have, yeah, that guy who's also on a lot of other cards, that shield and Sword of Deep Seated. No, give us a foil. Still really cool to open those though, but awesome, awesome Metal Raiders OCG pack. All right, let's follow Metal Raiders with Metal Raiders. Why not? 25th anniversary. This is our only Metal Raiders 25th anniversary pack, so maybe it'll bless us with the Pecanio Moth. Here we go, Leo Gun. Tainted Wisdom. Okay, I was right to switch it. Rainbow Flower. There I am, the Pale Beast. Gotta pull that one out. Jinzo, the original Jinzo. Oh, and the Pecanio Moth. What an awesome pack. So many cards to talk about in there. Metal Raiders is killing it. We're not even to the foil yet. White Magical Ad and... Oh, a Gay Guardian! No way! That was the perfect Metal Raiders pack! Let's go! Gay Guardian, Pequeno Moth, the Pale Beast Rux in 34! Oh, Metal Raiders coming through for us again. All right, that was sick. Here's our last Darkwing Glass pack. That was, that was really cool. One, two, three, four. That was the perfect Metal Raiders pack. Silent Wolf, here we go. The Great Noodle. Black Shadow Squall, Celestius, Hanshi, Amazonus. We got the Tri Brigade Showdown, Ninjutsu Art of Dancing Leaves, and ooh, a Muckraker from the Underworld. That is a secret rare. All right, that's a pull back to back. Nice secret rares. Our total value starting to add up a little bit, right, guys? We have a uh, last movie pack, secret edition. This was one uh, special edition, so it's been a pretty good special edition so far. If we can get Mahad or Keep Eyes, that's good. Or an alternative would be big. We have Crystal, Grey Magician Girl, also pretty good. We got a couple of those. And we have the Celtic Guardian of Noble Arms. Still a really good special edition for that. This has turned into a pretty epic opening so far. I mean, we still got a lot of old school packs, so it could get even better. We have a Cheated Heart. We have Yuriza, Thunder Giant, Tempest, nice card. Banisher of the Radiance, also a good card, a little bit annoying to play against. And the Electrum, so very solid le uh, legendary collection too. Stratos and Voltic. Also both good cards. So, so far, I mean, it's been a pretty solid opening. It's been pretty, pretty solid. One, two, three, four, three, right? Three, I think on this. What? Okay, never mind. I'm looking at my recording and my computer is barely using any CPU right now, which is really great. Kalantos, I'm surprised it's so low. We have a uh, Ghost Trick Skeleton, nice. All right, Shadow Spectres. The all right counter is probably at like seven right now. Okay, no, that's probably it. That's probably it. low balling it, probably more than that. Chain Ignition, we have Drew Drew. Come on, Zexel Packs. You guys are really holding us back right now. Get something crazy like an Ultimate Rare. We have a Aratama and... No, still, still holding us back a little bit. They're just like Obi-Wan holding back Anakin Skywalker. Okay, I'm just kidding. Didn't happen. Didn't happen. Obi-Wan, we stand him around here. Okay, Galactic Overlord, this is your chance to turn it around. We have Insector Earwig, pretty weird name. We have Red-Headed Oni, the Bouncer Guard, a Bootin. A <laughs> little Bootin. Oh, it's so cute. We gotta put that aside. Okay. And we have, ooh, a Super Queen Dragon Dijin. We'll take that. We at least got a foil. That's a plus. And now it's time for Retro Pack 2. Here we go, guys. I'm doing four, but I'm scared that it's going to move if it's a foil. Book of Tai, you have Bear behind the door. 
Gravekeeper's Chief, the Parasite Parasite. Gravekeeper's Spy, that's a pretty good common right there. Lightning Blade, Spirit Message in. We got the L and the N, here we go. Torrential Tribute, also a great common. And a Dark Necro Fear. We've got a foil. It's just a super, so it's not like huge, but Dark Necro Fear is a really, really classic card. So we'll definitely take that. Another nice foil. All right, all right. We are heating up a little bit. Very nice. Got some good pulls so far. Gorgonic Guardian is a nice card. We have Ghost Trick Museum, The Skeleton, Sylvan Blessing, Gorgonic Guardian, Purge Ray, Swordsman from a Distant Land, The Guardiok, Number C92, and a do 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 Busta. Last Chaos Impact of the video. Can we get the legendary IP Masquerade? Those opened kind of weird. That was weird. I don't, that was, it like opened on the top. Okay, one, two, three. Not feeling too good about that, but you know, that's just how it goes. Here we go. We have World Legacy. Moran says Wonderheart, Spiral Dragon, watch me be like, yeah, I don't feel good about that, there's a Starlight. We have Mega, we have Crasher, Evil Eye. Okay, so I guess I was right to not feel good about that one. Let's do another Photon Shock Wave. Let's shock the waves, here we go. One, two, three, can we get a Ghost Rare? Or an Ulti, or even an Ultra would be awesome. Laval, Lance Lord, a lot of good cards in this set. Monster Slot, Maturia, not a set I've opened that much though, so I don't know it super well. Zen Mark. Okay, just a rare. All right, common, I should say. Final pack of Rage Raw. Last chance at a Ghost Rare here. Ghost Rare. We already pulled Egyptian God Slime, which is pretty sick. So, I mean, a Ghost Rare would be nice. We got Wizzell. We got Resolute Mechlord Army. And a Monster Reborn. We will reborn our Ghost Rare pulls. I also threw in one King's Court, so we might as well open this too. Let's see if we can get the God cards here. We couldn't get the Winged Dragon and Raw Ghost, but maybe we could get the Winged Dragon and Raw Ultra Pharaoh's Rare or Secret Pharaoh's Rare. We have number C39. CW and a crystal girl. Valiant, valiant effort. Will you give us a valiant ghost rare? One, two, three. I want that Mobius. I don't, Mobius actually is one of the best looking ones. I'm not gonna lie. Even though it's a low value one, I mean, if you're looking for nice looking cardboard, that is one. We have Mighty Warrior. That's a synchro I've maybe never seen. Override, we have Rank Down, and oh, a number 101, Silent Honor Arc. This also has an ultimate rare, so fortunately we didn't get that, but this, I mean, it also got a Ghost Rare in Duels from the Deep. Really cool to see the original Ultra Rare. It's, it was a crazy card back then. Those Laval packs are not doing bad, I'm not gonna lie. They're doing pretty solid. We have a Galactic Overlord. I just wanna pull, you know, like an ulti or a ghost out of these, like one of them, one of the sets at least. Mini Guts, we have Return. He's returning his stuff. We have Lady D for the third time. We have Camera Clops, Boot, no, just such a cool card. Man, what set is this again? Galactic Overload, this has so many awesome comments. We gotta open this more. Absorbing Jar, I don't know if I've ever seen this Jar card. Look at that little face, it's like a satellite or something. And Gaia Dragon, the Thunder Charger, is this old? I didn't realize that. These Zexal packs are starting to heat up. Let's see if Cosmo Blazer can continue the trend and give us a Hard Earth Dragon. We already got the C92, Hard Earth, whatever the difference is. You know, I think this is still C92. Hazy Flames in here. Cool cards. Nice archetype. Drac Impact. We've got the Hierology Reborn. And a Noble Arms Caliburn. That, I think, is actually, like, over a dollar for some reason. I guess it doesn't have a reprint. You know, if you're playing, what is that, Noble Knights? There's no way people are playing that these days. All right, one Eternity Code. First edition. I'm going to do three because I don't know what it is. Magical Hound. Release the Hound. Lantern. Deep Sea, AIQ, Deep Sea Minstrels, Pinpoint Dash, Witchcrafter, Unveiling Sewers. Retro Pack 2, only our like fourth pack of this. We still have a lot more packs here. Can we pull? So it was four from the back on the Necrofear, so that means we were doing it right. We have Dark Spirit, we have Spirit Message Eye, we have three of the four, or three of the five. Opticlops, Azura Priest, nice goat card. Call of the Haunted, we have Dark Room of Nightmare, Blue Eyes Shining Dragon, appear to us, oh no. Not the L again, not the L again. We have a Spear Dragon. L is not a good sign, or is it? United, we stand. The L has been defeated with the Handshake of Destiny. Let's do a Force of the Breaker pack. I've not opened any of these yet. These are unlimited uh, EN packs. I mean, I think they're always EN for Force of the Breaker, but this could have some pretty cool stuff. There's some nice ultimate rares in here. Breakthrough, we have a Magna Strash, Slash Dragon, Strash. Otherworld, the A-Zone, we have Volcanic Recharge. Crystal Beast, Ruby Carbuncle, and a Ancient City Rainbow Ruins. It might be after this. Crystal Beast, Cobalt Eagle. I don't know if there's foils and rares. I think there is, but we'll find out maybe later in more packs. Here is our 25th anniversary Legend of Blue Eyes pack. So the Metal Raiders pack went pretty hard. Let's see if this one can do the same. 
Tripwire Beast trying to trip us up. We got Follow Wind, Armored Starfish, Enchanting Mermaid, Trial of Nightmare, Petite Angel, Mystical Moon, Spirit of the Zaharp, and a Man Eater Bug. All right, it's a foil. We'll take it. Turned out to be a pretty good 25th anniversary opening that we had right there, especially that Gate Guardian. We are getting down to uh, the back row almost at this point, which is pretty exciting because this is the big stuff one two three on the laval which has been good to us just give us an ulti or a ghost and then laval you have crushed it we have gorgonic gorgonic guardian we have kalantoso interplanet probably thorny beast okay <laughs> i just you just lose all the ability to talk when you see that and black brachios that was good in the dino deck and duel links for a while got a couple more legendary collection twos might as well open them now or open one of them now i should say we have non-fusion area that's dinged we have cold enchanter we have phenomenon in the king poison snakes not a great super and oh an alt art elemental hero avian that's a good one and a crystal tree which actually isn't that bad either because of the crystal beast support okay so that was a kind of an average pack but the avian's a nice secret rare let's spec the shadow i don't even know what that means i probably shouldn't say stuff i don't know what it means because that can turn into a bad thing like when i was rhyming uh Rhyming with duck in first grade, let me tell you, that did not go well when I asked the lunch lady um, why, what if the F word was a bad word, <laughs> and I said it. Mythical tree, we, it was a classic, but uh, don't do that at, at home, ladies and gentlemen. Number 64, and oh, a Genomix fighter, ultra rare. I've never seen that card in my life, but it's an ultra rare, so that's gotta be good, right? Anything that tastes this good has to be good for you. What kids movie is that from? In the early 2000s, let me know in the comments. If you made it to this far in the video, and you can answer that question. You're a legend. We have Xyz Wrath. We have Overlay Owl, Nimble, Dragon Skay. Uh, we have Gamusha. I don't know. I'm reading these completely wrong. And number 25, Force Focus, the camera. Very nice. We pulled a camera out of Galactic Overload. We're getting a lot of Xyz Ultras, which I think is probably a lot of them are Xyz Ultras because it's the Xyz era. But where are the ultis, though? I am eagerly awaiting our first ulti. I'm hoping that, I mean, hopefully we're going to get one, right? Out of all these packs. I mean, not everything could pull an ulti, but we have a lot of ulti packs, so we want to get at least one, right? One, two, three. We've got a lot of ultras, which has been great. Leotar, which means these are definitely not weighed, which is great. Uh, I said, which is great, like four times right there. We have Fire Fist, Raven, Tensu. We got ZW and uh, Goku Ghost. Speaking of ghosts, Photon Shockwave. I know you, you heard what we just said. Ghost rares, they are in your pack. The set that you are, they are available. Or there is one that is available at least. Come on, Prior of the Ice Barrier, Sound the Retreat, we got Wind Up Warrior, Vanilla, Creepy. Not Creepy Coney, but it's like his little brother. We have Ray Rider, Acorno, classic. They had some really great commons back in Zexel. Junk Defender and uh, Evo Karma. It is time for another champion pack eight. We have 10 of these today. So let's see. I remember the spoilers were on the front. So I'm going to do like this so we don't spoil. I think the one one to the back was actually right last time, right? It was a rare. We have Alien Warrior. We have Royal Oppression. This is a crazy common, so very good. And Great Shogun Sheen, just a rare. Okay, eh, it's cool stuff. Let's open one of our few raging battles that we have. Speaking of ghosts and ultis, I mean, same thing here. We're 5Ds era. Let's see, not a lot of 5Ds in this opening today, so I'm hoping that maybe these can be bangers, the ones that we do have. We have Guardian. Scope in. That's a Ruxin special. We have Mirror of Oaths, Double Tool CD, Bind. Oh, and it is a banger! Whoa, I did a... I don't even know what happened to that pack trick. Ultimate Rare, Earthbound Immortal, kick a pack a boo Let's take a second to appreciate our first Ultimate Rare. It is the legendary Pokeball. You'll love to see it. I think we are far enough into the opening to open one of our Asian English Legend of Blue Eyes first editions. I think I have like seven of these, so... We're hoping there's some foils inside. I mean, I don't really know. We got these loose from that guy, so they could may or may not have foils. Oh yeah, remember the foil was in the back. We did it in the mail video. Violet Crystal, so first edition LOB. It's Asian English. The difference is that Asian symbol on the back instead of the US symbol. Here we go. Beast Fangs, these feel like old cards, which is awesome. I mean, they are old. They're 2003, I think. Book of Secret Arts, The Wasteland, The Land of Waste. Legendary Sword, can we, if we get a blue eyes, I'm gonna be hyped. I mean, Dark Magician would be great. Obviously, all the good stuff. Forest, there's so many good cards in here. We have Karama. These Sintering is crazy. By the way, I know if it irritates you, I talk about Sintering. It's just a thing I do. I grade cards, okay? Karama, we have Power of Kaishin. And here we go. Will we get something crazy? Oh, a 
Celtic Guardian. We did get a foil. Celtic Guardian. Speaking of centering, this thing looks really good. Maybe slightly that way, but I think it's definitely in the range. That is beautiful. Definitely going to be grading this. I mean, the value with these is a lot less than LOB NA first edition, obviously. But there is some value to these, so I'm definitely going to grade this. It'll be fun. Retro pack two time. We got a lot of them, so we might as well keep sprinkling them in. That's pretty cool. Celtic Guardian. I mean, that, that's pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. Maybe that's going to lead us up into something crazy out of our NA heavy pack. Was it three? I think it's four, right? Yeah, Milk of the Four-Faced Beast. Four-Star Ladybug of Doom. Come on, Blue Eyes Shining Dragon. Spirit Message Eye. Gravity Bind. Call of the Hunted. A Legendary Ocean. Here's where we could pull the Legendary Secret Rare. Here we go. Oh, wait, no, it's not. Mad Sword Beast. Here's where we could pull it. Royal Decree. Okay, good card. It's a good card, okay? It's a good card, but it is not the card we're searching for. That's okay. Let's go to... I do have one slightly newer pack, Phantom Rage. I mean, that's a 2014 pack, by the way. <laughs> wait, no. Wait, that's not right. 2014, 27? Wait. I'm getting this mixed up with uh, New Challengers. This is uh, Zeus, so this is 2020. Yeah, New Challengers, a very similar look, but this one is a lot newer, obviously. New Challengers is 2014. Hanabi, we have Trapper, we have Unbreakable Mind. I mean, I like a, Z a Zeus right now, it'd be pretty cool. Okay, it's, it's an Xyz, but it's not a Zeus, but well, we can ask, right? If you guys are enjoying the video so far, don't forget to subscribe, because yeah, I mean, we hit 200K, but we want to hit even higher at some point. That'd be really cool and do more specials like this. So that'll be, you know, maybe even better in the future. Who knows? And once again, shout out to Sassiato for being a legend and supporting me and supporting our 200K special. So don't forget to go check him out. We have Pon Poco, we have O Token Bomb, and Skelosaurus. Come on, Shadow Specters, where are your pulls? Galactic Overlord got the camera last time, which was a good sign because we are recording with a camera, right? So that means we, it's gotta be a good sign, right? It just makes sense. We have a boot and let's just go ahead and pull that out because that's a legendary card. One, two, three, from the back, I think. We have Moonlit Papillion. Doom Donuts, that's also such a cool card. So many good commons. Camera Clops, Hieratic Seal, Insector Giga Cricket, okay. And a Tasuke Knight, that's a super rare. All right, first super in a bit from those, so we'll take that. Let's do another Photon Shockwave first edition. Come on, guys. One, two, three. We have Wind Up Warrior, Zin Mayark, Prior of the Ice Barrier, Shark Stickers, a traffic control, poisonous winds, road nut. Oh, the road nut. <laughs> that is a name right there. Junk defender and an ultimate rare Evelzor Lagia. And this is an awesome card. Such a strong card for dinosaurs. Even to this day, it's used in their extra deck for dinos. This is one of the crazy cards for Dino Rabbit back in the day. So this is one of the absolute best cards you can pull. The value's gotta be at least, I'd say 20, but maybe even more than that because it's used like as a one of in a current dino deck and dinos just got support. So this might've just gone up. This could be insane. Lagia is really good because it's a negate. I think it's an Omni negate, right? Yeah, this one is an Omni negate which means it can negate spell trap or monsters if you guys are not players all the time which i am sometimes not but i did play dinos for a while now if i wanted an ultimate rare that is a good one wow that is a sick pull evils are log yeah that that's cool i'm excited about that champion pack eight you know what let's just continue it the pulls have been pretty awesome so far so i'm hoping that we can continue that and pull something amazing i mean champion pack eight you could pull us Illumina. that would be really awesome we have Alien Mother, we have Beckoning Light, and a Necro Gardener, okay. So, I mean, some good stuff. So, a lot of Light Sworn support in there. I mean, it makes sense. Illumina, you know, we got the Beckoning Light. Necro is good in Light Sworn as well. Let's do a set we haven't done yet, Legacy of Darkness. And we are looking for those secret rares out of here. There's great Ultras and everything, but the secret rares are the absolute favorites. We have Injection Fairy Lily, we have Yada Garasu. Let's try and pull those. I think it would be four from the back on Originals. We have... Lizard Soldier, there's no reprints of this set, so it's pretty old. The Puppet Magic of Dark Ruler, Grey Wing, Spiritual Energy. We have Super Robo Lady, the Troop Dragon, Feng Xing Mirror, and will we get that Secret Rare? No, we will get the Susa Soldier, which is what we always seem to get for some reason. Very cool stuff. We got Legacy of the Valiant First Edition. Been good to us so far. I'm so hyped about that uh, Photon Shockwave pull. Logia is a sick card. I mean, it, it's not like an old school one as much, you know, obviously. I mean, but it, at this point, it's like 11 years old when Dino Rabbit was good. Or was that 12 years? I think it was 2011. Sentinel, we have... Maybe it's 2012. I think that came out in 2012. C69 and a Fairy Knight. All right, we're getting so many XCs cards. I always think we're going to get a ghost, but then I remember it's not even XCs ghost rare in there. Shadow Spectres. Yep, been great to us. 
you're like one of the only sets that's kind of, you know, been, been a bomb so far. So let's see if you can turn around. Kind of makes sense because you are known as one of the worst sets of all time. But you do have awesome ultimate rares that I want to pull. We have Survival of the Fittest. Come on. Cha Cha Chan. Treak Shield. We have Baby Raccoon. Bong Poco. Vivid Knight. And. Bushinki Abyss. They're just not turning around right now. Galactic Overlord. I guess we had. We had a couple of pulls out here. These haven't been insane, but we have had a couple of pulls. Better than Shadow Spectres. We can pull something crazy, though, and really take a leap here for how good this set was. Lady of D. We've pulled like four Lady of D, so that's that's pretty insane. Nibble Manta. We have Hieratic Seal. Falling Current. Hieratic Seal again. And an Evil Tile. El Janeiro. Okay, that's a super. I mean, that's adding to the lore there. The lore of the pulls. Very epic. OTS 21. The newest OTS set. Will we get an ultimate rare out of here? Let's find out. We have Trap Hole of Spikes. Galaxy Expedition. And... Light of the Branded. So we got a little branded action for you branded players out there. You know what it's time for. The Retro Pack 2. We've got one super so far. So I'm hoping for, for better pulls coming up. One, two, three, four. I want a Secret Rare, especially Shining Dragon. We have Melkid. Four Star Ladybug of Doom. Magic Drain. Spirit Message Eye. Gravity Bind. Call of the Haunted. A Legendary Ocean. Mad Sword Beast. And we have a Swift Gaia, the Fierce Knight, Ultra Rare. Wait, no, that's not right. We pulled an Ultra already. We pulled uh, United We Stand. So now we have three pulls. Swift Gaia, United We Stand, and the Dark Necro Fear. Going pretty well of these Retro Pack 2 packs. We're really just looking for that secret rare now. Okay, and here's a fun one. If we want to pull Blue Eyes Shining, might as well open a movie pack, which it is not guaranteed in here, by the way. I'm just saying. I don't know if it's going to show us right off the bat. It is not. Good job, Konami. Shonen Jump. There's only one card in here. There's a four card set. One of them's Blue Eyes Shining, the super rare. Let's see if we can get it. We can! The Blue Eyes Shining Dragon! Let's go! Super rare! I can't wait to put in the title Blue Eyes Shining Dragon pull and trip all you guys out. I'm just kidding. I will not do that. But I probably will grade this card because it's kind of a sick card and very nostalgic for everybody who went to the movie back then. So... I'm happy with that. One pack magic. Speaking of one pack magic, let's do it here with Labyrinth and I. Okay, we have more than one pack, but this will be one pack we're opening right now, right? We're not opening more than one at the same time. I'm just saying. So let's see if we can get something crazy. One, two, three, four. Grand Tiki Elder. Cure Mermaid. Come on. Keep your Drakborn. There's a lot of great cards in Labyrinth of the Nightmare. I'm not, I mean, we've already pulled United Beast Stand out of one set. Let's just do it again. Unfriendly Amazon. We have Swordsman of Landstock. Classic. And Gillosaurus. We've already pulled that guy too. A free special summon back in the day. Still got some Valiant Packs. A couple left. So I'm still holding out hope that there's an ulti or a ghost in one of these. Because there's some good ones in Legacy of the Valiant. Ghost Rick Spectre. Or Skeleton. That's a different card. Ghost Rick. Uh, Nico. The Gorgonic Guardian. Pulled that like every pack. Photon Charge Man. Hidden Temples, and an Imperial Tombs of the Necro Valley Secret Rare. Very nice, Imperial Tomb. Shadow Specters, you've been bad for us so far. You've, you've just did not been great, okay? It's been rough. Let's see if you can turn it around. I might have spoiled something right there. I couldn't see. We have Mythic Water Dragon. Let's find out. Yellow Bellied. Resetsu, Secret Secrets, Gaga, -ga -ga, the Bujin. We have a Mega Fan of Beast and a number 46, Draglu Dragluon. And this card was, act I don't think it's Dragluion, <laughs> definitely. But this card was actually pretty good in Duel Link. So now you guys guess. This card actually has an ultimate rare print. It was like 40 bucks. I think it's like one of the best cards in the set. I once pulled that card. It's a really nice looking ultimate rare. So I would have been happy with that one. Super still pretty cool. Galactic Overlord, I believe in you. You can pull something big. We can pull that ghost rare we've been searching for. We've got a couple ultis so far. I'd take another one of those. Light Ray Daedalus. Phantom Bouncer. We got Falling. We got Hieratic Dragon. And a Hieratic Seal of Reflection. That's another super rare. We'll take it. Photon Shockwave. You've already you kind of exceeded expectations with that Logia Ultimate Rare. I'm super happy about that. If you want to pull the Ghost Rare too, then you might become my new favorite set. It might happen. We have Pineco. We have uh, Pineco. That is, uh, that's different. That's Pokemon. We have Acorno, which, you know, you can check out Pokerux if you guys want to see some Nuzlocke action. We have a Mirror Wall. We have Evelzar Pelta. And an Evil Tile. West Low. All right. Cool. More Super Rares. Back to our Champion Pack 8. I'm wondering what our value is looking like. I bet it's not looking too bad. It's definitely probably worth a couple hundred bucks, right? Pulled a lot of good stuff. I mean, a couple good Ultimate Rares. You know, some Secrets. We got Vanity's Rules. Some nice Commons and Rares and stuff like that. Here we go. Magician's Valkyria. That might be worth money as well, knowing uh, 
you know, Magician of Valkyria and all those DMG cards. Technically not a DMG card. Don't get triggered by that. I know it's not actually a DMG card. Let's open another Force of the Breaker. Let's see what we can get. We're almost at the hour recording mark, so probably shorter for you guys, but it's been a long video so far. We still got a long way to go, so it's going to be pretty epic. I hope to end it. Volcanic Scatter Shot. It's been a great start, so I hope it continues. Secrets of the Gallant. We have Grave Huber's Commandant and a Blaze Accelerator Common, so they're getting support coming out, so could be a good card. I do have one Duelist Alliance pack that I found, so let's open this up. I have never pulled anything good out of this set, really. I mean, Constructs in here. That'd be awesome. There's a Ghost Rare in here. There's the cover card, whatever that Pendulum Dragon guy is called. We have Monic Stormforth. We have Recover. I feel like this might be the weird pack trick, so it might be coming up. Draco Ascension. I feel like that would have been it. We have a rare, and yeah, I think I was right about that. So nothing in that Duelist Alliance, as usual. Last pack of Legendary Collection 2. We only have a couple packs left in front of the back row, which means we are, you know, getting through this opening. We got a D-Shield. We have an H-Heated Heart. Elemental Hero Woodsman, not bad. Cyber and Dragon alternate art. I still like the original art better, but I think this one's cool as well. And then a ca cash is bad. Okay, we have an ocean. Okay, that was not bad. Cyber and Dragon is always really cool. Shadow Specters, I know you hear me. I know you hear me in there. I know you got a ghost rare in there. Somewhere, we have Ghost Rick Vanish. Oh, maybe the ghosts are vanishing. Maybe that's what it is. Mal Severus Knife, Pump Princess, Mega Venom Beast, Sacred Serpent. We have Battle and Boxer, Rib Gardener. We have Peralis, the Purple Pyro Tile, and <laughs> Dragon Chill. Man, I cannot read. Yes, we have not pulled anything out of Shadow Specters again. I, I feel like we literally have pulled nothing. I think that that's accurate. I think it's literally over. Something ceremony. Come on, Galactic Overlord. This is your chance to really turn it around for Shadow Specters. You're going to help assist them. Lady of D for the seventh time. Very nice. We have Hieratic Dragon and we have a Flelf. A little Flelf action. Super rare Flelf. That is kind of hilarious. I'm going to just put the last two Legacy of the Valiant in the front. So, uh, or at least in the back part. So we don't have to like, you know, we're, we're on to the back part at this point. OTS 13. Let's open this up. I don't know where this is going to appear. Might be in the front. It is not. Lady of White. We have Bottomless Trap Hole and a Bahamut Shark. Pretty good super rare. Not bad. Not the worst thing ever. We got two more Force of the Breaker. So let's open one of these real quick. I think we're going to open an LOB Ancient English again after this. See what we can get, you know, because that last time we got a Celtic Guardian. That was pretty cool. We got Amber Mammoth, Crystal Abundance, Hard Selling Goblin, the Field Barrier, Crystal Beast Amethyst Scat, Backs to the Wall, A Cell Breeding Device, Sky Scourge, and Rise. That's a super. There it is. It might be four from the back. That is a very, <laughs> very subtle super rare look at that it is like on four spots that's it that is a very light super rare but hey it's a super rare <sighs> lob first edition asian english come on let's pull something epic let's get something look how these open there's like an extra plastic layer that's kind of weird okay i mean it is kind of like an asian pack which they kind of do those uh for ocg but it's a little bit different than that one two three Oh, no, no, no pack trick. Remember that Karama, no pack trick on this one. Forest, we're going to get a blue eyes. It's going to be damaged because of the back card. Wasteland, Mystical Sheep number two, King Fog, Legendary Sword. We got Beast Fangs, Book of Secret Arts, cool card. And finally, will it be the blue eyes white dragon? No, it's a giant soldier of stone. Legacy of the Valiant, you've been good to us so far. Let's be great to us. How about that? One, two, three. 200K video. Hope you, Hopefully you guys have enjoyed all the festivities. It's been fun. Let me know if you've enjoyed, you know, Legacy Week, the ISC opening, this opening, the live stream. There's been a lot of stuff. And I've really had fun doing like multiple videos. I think we'll maybe do this in the future for other ones. I have one Primal Origin that I just randomly had a one of. So we'll just open this one. Here we go. One, two, three. Watch Primal Origin have the Ghost Rare. Just a one of Ghost Rare. would be crazy. Singularity. We have Ghost Rare Doll. We have Add the Bland played on and the Band played on. Stardust and those are creepy. Artifact. We have Vanish Shage. Why can't I read? It's because it's been an hour, guys. It's been a long time. Number 80. I'm losing it as we go. Oh, what a number C-107. Neo Galaxy Eyes Tachyon Dragon. That is not a bad card either. We'll take it. Shadow Specters. I'm expecting you to pull something good. Here we go. One, two, three. I shouldn't expect it, but here we go. We have Bujingi Centipede, The Knife, Yukiona, Mansion, Tree Dragon, Wyvern Burster, Battle and Boxer, Cheat Commissioner, and a baby, Raccoon, Farfus Cat. Galactic Overlord. Man, Shadow Specters has been a dud. I feel like almost every time I open Shadow Specters, there's just nothing in it. Like not, e like, not even foils. Like, there's not just bad cards. There's just no foils. One, two, three. Ghost Rare Time. Red Edit Oni. Overlay Eater. Constellar Belt. Doom Donuts. Blade Bouncer. Hieratic Dragon of Newit. We have the Dragon. We have Photon Papal Operative. And a Hieratic Dragon of Supremacy. Back to the Blazing Cosmos. I don't know if Cosmo Blazer... I think we've got, like, maybe, like, one foil out of Cosmo Blazer so far. 
Hasn't been awesome so far. We can definitely turn around. These have all been dinked too, the Cosmo Blazers. That one was a little bent up. We have Red Dustin. We have Hawk. Go Go Ghost. Zero Zero Rock. Tenson. Ultimate Shield. The Star Drawing, a classic. Yeah, just like TCG player, baby. We got a rare right there and Fire Formation. Didn't get. I also got some Duelist packs. We have Duelist pack Zane. We already opened Yugi and Kaiba. So let's open Zane up, see if we can pull like a Cyber in. I don't know what kind of foil or pack trick. We're just going to go through it. We have Cyber Dark Keel. I think it's in the middle. Generator unit. Cyber Dark Dragon. We did get one of the Zane cards. Cyber Dark Dragon. Super rare. Let's go. It's probably one of the best cards in the set. Usually they're not like high value out of the Duelist packs, but that is really cool. Duelist pack Zane, baby. We do be taking those. Let's go champion pack eight so far no pull these are, i mean it's pretty hard to pull stuff out of champion pack it's like one in 12 for a super i think so the odds are against us to actually get something but that's why i did 10 packs so we at least have a chance we have mushroom man the og not mushroom man number two mushroom man and then a great shogun shit we got to pull out that mushroom man that is an epic guard back to retro pack two you've been good to us so far we're just looking for that high rarity seeker rare baby come on one two three you know you want to four actually Card of safe return. Four star ladybug of doom. Here could be the moment an hour into the video. So your message I, how crazy would that be? Like an insane pull like that being an hour into a video. Yadagarasu, that's a great card. Spear dragon, torrential tribute, and Don Zalug. Also probably a good rare because I don't think he has a lot of reprints. I think he does have speed dual prints, so he at least has those. This is our last legacy of the Valiant pack. You've been good to us, you've been Valiant. You wanna end off with a bang legacy of the Valiant? Let's find out. XC shift. Avenger, Dark Artist, Kalentos, Wing Sphinx, Tackle Crusader, Sylvan Guardiok. We've got Ghost Trick Dullahan and Ghost Trick Jack Frost. What a way to end. We are starting to get down toward the end. We're definitely over 100 packs in, I would say. So Shadow Specters, now's your time. Maybe we're just waiting until the second 100 of packs to pull, actually pull something. We have Punpoko. Let's see. Big win. Soul Drain Dragon, Vampire Kingdom, The Puncher. We've got Mega Phantom Beast and Chapter Chan. So no, they're just not gonna pull anything, I think. There's one more pack of Shadow Spectres and then it's it's kind of over at that point. <sighs> one, two, three. Galactic Overlord. We have Shadow Tail Butterfly. Gamusha, Sue, Overlay Owl, Mini Guts. Return, Lady of D again, Hieratic Dragon and Hieratic Seal of the Dragon King. That's why nobody cares about the set. It's all Hieratic Dragon guards. Last Cosmo Blazer. My voice is starting to feel it at this point. It's been a lot of talking, a lot of talking. Let's go. Cosmo Blazer, give us that hot earth dragon ghost rare. Double back, we have Sunbird, we have Ultimate Shield, Beast Unicorn, Drac Impact, Infernal Flame, and oh, Brotherhood of the Firefist Horse Prince. This is actually worth a few bucks, I know, because I've listed a few on my TCG player. Very nice stuff, but don't, oh no, we have one more Cosmo Blazer, that wasn't the end. Photon Shock Wave, the wave of the shocks that has destroyed this pack. But this has been good to us so far. Give us that Galaxy Eyes Photon Dragoon. Here we go, Vylon Ohm, Heartfelt. Evil Tile, Naturia Marion, Monster, Shark, Fiery Fervors, Baby Trigon, and the Stinging Swordsman. <laughs> Look at that little girl. Is that a girl or maybe it's not? A, I don't know. I'm not, I'm not going to. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Let's open a little Duelist Pack Jaded Yuki. I don't even know the best card in here. I don't know what it would be. Probably like a Flame Wing Man or something. I think that's a rare, actually. I don't know. Spark Man. Cool. We have Clay Man. All right, good guess so far. And a Wing Karibo level 10. We already pulled the level 9 out of GX earlier, so getting all the Wing Karibos. We just need the regular Wing Karibo now. Champion Pack 8. Give us a Champion Pack pull. Come on, just one foil out of the... I mean, we have other Champion Packs as well, and I don't expect those to, you know, have anything really, let's be honest. So I'm hoping that this does. We have a Neospatial Dark Panther. I have a good feeling about this pack. Royal Oppression. I have a good feeling about this pack. That's great. And... A gravity behemoth ultra rare let's go it felt a little bit like a foil like it felt like it had like a, some little like back in the day they had like this weird texture to them and i thought i felt it so gravity behemoth looks like i was right plus it had a royal oppression which is like a ten dollar common or something so that's an incredible pack let's follow that up with a retro pack too We've had some amazing pulls in this video. It's been great. I'm just hoping that we can follow it up with some, you know, at least the same, maybe even better pulls to finish. Four, four from the back, not three. We have Mask of Restrict. Do not restrict us from the secret rares. Four Star Lady Book of Doom. Dark Spirit of the Silent. Yata Garasu. Spear Dragon. Torrential Tribute. Let's open a pack for Yata after this. We have Grave Fever Assailant. 
and a legendary fisherman. So no, 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 we did not get him. Okay, don't worry. Now let's open for the Yada. Like I said, we got a Yada common. Let's get a Yada secret rare. How cool would that be to get back to back? Come on, one, two, three. I don't even know if this can get a Yada. It might be Injection Fairy Lily, to be honest. We have a legendary ocean. I take that though. Robo Yaru, Fiend Comedian, Wolf Axe Wielder, Spirit Ryu, Spiritual Energy Settled Machine, Super Robo Lady, Troop Dragoon, and a Twin-Headed Behemoth. That's a super rare. We'll take it. L-O-N, super rare. Very nice. Let's just finish this off, this painful arc of the Shadow Spectres. Let's just close out their arc, you know. It hasn't been good. It hasn't been fun to watch. It's been rough. One, two, three. Let's end it here. Let's get a Ghost Rare, you know, an epic comeback. Rabbit Puncher, Tan Tan, that we would have never expected. Ghost Rick Witch, Vampire Duke. And the ending we expected, a comment. Don't worry, we got those out of the way. They were only the, you know, really the only duds of the video so far. Galactic Overlord, this is in fact your last pack. Can we get something? Light Ray Daedalus, Phantom Bouncer, Falling Current, Lady of D. I think we literally have like a like eight of those at this point. Doom Donuts, that's cool. Blade Bouncer, Hieratic Dragon. We have Light Ray Diablos and Sealing Ceremony of Raton. And here's that last Cosmo Blazer pack that I missed earlier. Did I miss potentially a Ghost Rare or an Ultimate Rare? One, two, three. We have Leotar. We have Dimension Gate. Spell Wall. Hieratic Beast Basilisk from Harry Potter. Spike Shield. Bacon Saver. Crimson Sunbird. We've got a Black Wing Damascus. The Polar Knight. Okay. <laughs> and an Ultra Rare. Artorigus. Artorigus. Yeah, Artorigus. King of the Noble Knights. I was right the first time. Should have stuck with that. So we ended with an Ultra on that pack. That's not bad. And we have another Photon Shockwave. I think we have two more of these, though. So this is not the last one. Road Nut. What? <laughs> What a classic one. Okay, three from the back. Wa Cobra, Zen Malfunction, Ego Boost, Road Nut. Got to pull that out. Evil Tile, One Day Apiece, Mirror Mail, Trap Shocking Virus, and an Extra Gate, another Super. I feel like we've pulled like six Supers out of Photon Shockwave so far. Let's do a Yusei 3 Duelist Pack. So we already pulled Cyberdark Dragon out of one of our duelist packs, which is pretty sick. Let's see if we can pull a Yusei Classic Stardust. I don't even know if it's in here. Oh, a Centric Boy. All right. He is a boy and he's a Centric. That's a super. Those are not guaranteed. So never even heard of that card. So maybe it doesn't have any reprints and it's like a $10 super. That'd be great. Back to our Raging Battle, which had an Ultimate Rare last time. So I'm not expecting like too much here, but Ultimate Rare right next to a Ghost or anybody? That could be pretty cool. Oh, wait. I think last time it was like a five from the back situation, right? Like this. Let's just do that. Little special pack trick. Minoan Centaur. We have Omega. Reckon Power. We have Hedge Guard. Mind Trust. Tuner Capture. Proof of Powerlessness. Morphtronic Remote. And a Forbidden Chalice. Ultra Rare. If this was the ulti, this would be big money. But even as an Ultra, this is still a really awesome card. I was right. I did the pack trick. You know, a little special and it worked out. That was awesome. The banger packs continue. Retro pack two. We're looking at you. Give us the huge pull we're looking for. We have a lot of awesome pulls. Nothing has been like massive, massive yet. Like a lot of like solid mid-range pulls. Let's just do it right now. Let's make it happen. We have barrel behind the door. Spirit message eye. Parasite, parasite. Emergency provisions. Mad sword beast. Dark room of nightmare. Gil Source, I cannot pull these cards. Maybe that means something. Century, century swaps, <laughs> creature swap, and the Dark Geroid. All right, it said century swap. You're not getting a secret rare, no way. Let's do our last photon shockwave. Let's see if we can get that Ghost Rare Galaxy Eyes photon dragon. One, two, three. Last chance, Creepy Coney. Oh no, not you. With all answer, we somehow avoided a lot of those. Pine Kono, Vanilla, Watt Cancel, Ray Rider. A Corno, DD Telephon, and a Rabid Dragon. So we finally didn't get a foil out of Photon Shockwave. We've gotten like almost every pack has had a foil. And our last duelist pack of the opening, Chaz Princeton. Will there be an Ojama King inside? Who knows? Maybe, or Chathonian, who knows? Maybe I know. Maybe I'm insane. Ojama King. Chathoni. Oh my gosh. I'm so good. Oja Muscle. Why Dragon Head and an Arm Changer. Okay, just a rare. But that was still pretty insane how I called that. Let's give Labyrinth the Nightmare another chance. Let's try a little L O N. I was about to say, I don't know what I was, was going to say L O B for some reason. Then I realized I was not saying the right thing. Okay, four from the back. Grand Tiki Elder. Let's go. Cure Mermaid. Kibio Drakmore, not a bad card. Earl of Demise. This gentlemanly creature is extremely wicked, feared by man and fiend alike. He is a fiend, so he's feared by other fiends. Boneheimer. We have Unfriendly Amazon. Swordsman of Landstar. And 
infinite cards. We have infinite cardboard here. Oh, I was wrong. We do have another duelist pack. Duelist pack crow. Forgot about this guy. Crow, black wings. Here we go. We have black wing. Nice. Black return. All right. We got a super rare. Then you get an elf and the raven rare as well. Okay. So you get both. Bane, the steel chain. We got a black wing Bane. You'll love to see it. It's time, guys, to revisit Legend of Blue Eyes White Dragon Asian English. Packs I've never opened until today. So this has been a lot of fun. We've already gotten a super so far. I'm really hoping that we can get even more than that. Ultra Rare Seeker Rare would be great. Dark World Thorns, we have Drooling Lizard, Armor and Starfish, Terra the Terrible, Dark Energy, Kumu Toko, Dragon Treasure, Metabat, and a Flower Wolf. The wolf has flowers on it. We are getting low on packs, but we are not that low on Retro Pack 2 yet. We have a lot to come. Two ultras and a super so far. Come on, one, two, three, four. We want a secret rare. Book of Taiyu. Appropriate. Gravekeeper's Chief. Mask of Restrict. We got a creature swap again, not a whatever I said earlier. Light Force Sword. Yada Gadasu. Very nice. Good sign for later. Call the Haunted. Our final card of Retro Pack 2 pack. Here we go. An Air Knight. Parshath Rare. We still have an OTS 21, which is our probably our, definitely our newest pack. Not probably, definitely our newest pack left. Let's start with the Mud Dragon. Network, but we get an ulti out of here. No, a sprite red. Hey, not a bad card, sprites. Here's one we haven't done yet. We've done a spell ruler 25th. We have not done a magic ruler. This is an original print magic ruler pack. One, two, three, four. Obviously, we are looking for the blue eyes tune dragon. That would be amazing. Tyo number two, electric snake. We have Minar. This is relinquished in here as well. Flash assailant, peacock, wall shadow, stone ogre grotto. We have chain energy and Sinju of the thousand hand, not 10,000 thousand hands our last raging battle pack so far we've gotten a forbidden chalice and an ultimate rare kickback of poo so uh yeah it's gonna be tough to uh, top those but uh, you know what could top it ghost rare powerful dragon let's do it let's make it happen one two three i am down no wait wasn't it last time we did the crazy pack trick on this one i think we did supremacy berry alien dog psychic path morphtronic videon quackimiro guardian shura the blue flame good card urgent synthesis Ojama Country used to be a $10 rare, not anymore, and level returner. So Sangen made it on that artwork, but finally, not a foil out of Raging Battle. OTS 21, I think this is our, maybe our last one. We might have one more, not sure. We have Time Space Trap Hole, we have Trap Hole Spikes, and Tier Elements Merly. I said it right, Tier Elements, let's go, baby. Okay, no, we have an OTS 13. Let's just open that right now. It looks very similar to OTS 21. They've got the black and the white action going on there. We have Gravity Collapse. Goblin King and uh, Spiral Mission Rescue. Spirals. Okay, cool. Retro pack. We got a lot of you. So let's just keep opening. Let's just keep opening. I'm getting excited for that LOB uh, wavy pack, by the way. Wavy. Uh... Okay, one, two, three, four. Wavy um, first edition heavy. So like all the good stuff. Let's do that. Okay, we have Magic Drain. That was an upside down pack. That's been a good sign in the past before. Spirit Message Eye, Bazoo. Not out of retro pack, but other, other packs like Cyberdark. Impact, we have Premature Burial, Gravity Bind, Yada Gadasu, and a Limiter Removal. That is a super, isn't it? It is, you can barely tell, oh my goodness. That is almost slighter than that Inrise earlier. Okay, got another super, we'll take it. Champion Pack 8's been good to us, so let's continue here. We got an Ultra Rare last time, which was pretty insane. I mean, that is, that's crazy. Ultra Rare out of a Champion Pack. Those are 1 in 48, by the way, just throwing that out there. Pretty rare, I mean, we have a whole box, so obviously we knew we could potentially get one, but why is this not wanting to, okay, this is not working, but I don't want to spoil it. Don't spoil it. Okay, here we go. I go like this. There we go. That didn't work out well. I'll fix that in a second. Let's see if we can get another four. We have Cell Explosion Virus, Alien Warrior, and we have uh, Necro Garden. Okay, not a foil. All right, here's one that was bought by a member of the channel uh, for our EOJ box break that I kept sealed, and he said he wanted me to open it on a video. I forgot for a long time, but then I said, hey, I can throw in the 200K video if you want. So this is his pack. This is not my pull. Only one out of all these that is not my pull. So Zachary K, good luck on your pulls right here. I put that on there because I have an EOJ pack of my own, so I didn't want to get those confused. Uh, and also to remember to say that, it's stuck to my hand. Come on. Okay, I got the I got the name off my hand. That took a while. Zachary K, let's see if you got an ultimate rare. It'd be crazy. What if you got like a, the the classic, you know, the, the, sh the sh what is it called? Shining Phoenix Enforcer? One, two, three. I always get it mixed up, even though I could never pull it. Four from the back. We got a Mariner. Let's see if we can get him something good. Celestial Transformation, Whirlwind Weasel. Senku, Elemental Recharge, Layard the Liberator, H Heated Heart, Disney Hero Captain Tenacious, and 
Ah, oh, Miraculous Descent. All that waiting, I'm sorry, Zach. I'm sorry, it took so long. LOD, let's get you that yada. And by me, you, I mean myself, but let's pull it, you know, so you guys get to watch or whatever. And then, and then I'll be happy. Okay, I destroyed that pack completely. Let's see, Secret Rare, one, two, three, four. Can we pull something crazy? We have a Lizard Soldier. Disappear, Puppet Magic of Dark Ruler, Grey Wing, Patrician of Darkness, A Faint Plan, Skull Knight Nimorodos, Dragon's Rage, and a Royal Oppression. All right. So we're getting the LOD and the CP version. Royal Oppression. We will not be letting people special summon, or is it summon or special summon? I think it's special summon. Yeah. Special summon at all out of, you know, we're insane. Here is an IOC reprint pack. So I didn't even realize I had this in here. Let's open this. This is a 2017 reprint. So I think you do four and then swap or something like that. Lord Poison. We have Thunder Crash. I've been opening so many of the other ones. Shot Man, the Desperate Outlaw. Hiya! That was good luck for us in the uh, in the big Chop Man IOC first edition pull. Phibius Bugroth. We have Ojama Yellow. We have Berserk Gorilla and Burning Algae. Retro Pack 2. I'm still waiting. I'm still waiting for that blue eyes Shining Dragon. Come on. One, two, three, four. Come on. Everybody wants to see it, Shining Dragon. You want to be gradable this time, too. It'd be great. You know, as a 10. We got no one across out. We got a Gemini Elf. I mean, I don't care if it's like a 7. I'll be happy. Appropriate, we have Idol. We have Grave Hero Spy. Book of Moon. Guardian Sphinx. And the Gear Free, the Iron Knight. Just a rare. Let's go back to some other champion packs that I have here. We have a champion pack 3. So we don't really know if these are scaled or not, which means they're probably scaled. Just going to throw that out there. But just in case, we are going to open them up, you know, for a little fun. There's only a couple of them, so it's not like they're definitely scaled or anything like that. Okay. I mean, not like even if they are, so we're not going to miss out on anything. Okay, the rare was at the front. Okay, I needed to check that. So just a rare. So nothing too crazy there, but we do have one more of those. Maybe it will have like a Night Assailant or something. I think that, wait, no, not Night Assailant. Uh, Spirit Reaper, sorry. We also have two Champion Pack 2. He's going to have the, uh, you know, Magician of Faith, all that stuff, which would be pretty big. I don't know where these pop up either. It might be at the front. It might not. Let's find out. Yes, they are at the front. Magical Dimension, Terraforming, and Ceasefire. So we know for the next ones that they all will be at the back, or we'll have to put them to the back. Let's do another Blue Eyes White Dragon Asian English pack. Here we go. I think we've opened like four now or something. Or this will be our fourth. Because yeah, we have three left. This will be our fourth. We've opened, I mean, we opened one in another video too, so it'd be five. One, nope, no, 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 no back trick. We have Petite Dragon, not the Petite Moth. Mazura Zame, where's the Yame? We got Grotto. Lesser Dragon, come on, Blue Eyes White Dragon. We got Thorns. Drooling Lizard, Armored Starfish, we got Succubus Knight, and an Armored Ninja. We got a Celtic Guardian, but since then, it's been a little dry. Time for another LON Unlimited Pack. We're on a little bit of a dry streak here. We pulled up, you know, some good stuff throughout the entire video, but we want to, you know, get back on track, pull something crazy. Worm Drake, we have Amazon Archer. Supply, Blind Destruction, that is a Ruxin special. Is that a first of the video? Wow. Dark Door, Dream Sprite, I guess I'm killing it. Earthbound Spirit, we have Grave Robber's Retribution, and a Bazoo, the Soul Eater, getting us back on track. Super rare from LON, you love to see that. All right, now we open a very rare pack. So this is obviously not in English, you can tell right there, but Astral Pack 4, one of the absolute hardest packs to find when I did my every pack openings. And I did get a, uh, you know, foreign one. So I figured, you know what, let's open this in this video. So there's not a lot of, you know, cards in here. There's only three cards, but you can get the maxi. So maxi obviously is crazy. I think it might be at the front here as well. So I'm going to do this. Astro Pack 4. Oh, it wasn't at the front. Okay, wait, perfect. The mat. Will we get the ultimate rare? Maxi, let's go. We have Regiando, aka Reasoning. And oh, Black Wing Galoot. Let's go. Shout out to Alex Simo. Who thought Simo would show up in the 200K special? Back to Retro Pack. Come on. We're probably almost halfway through at this point. We have a couple Ultra, which, which is great. You know, Ultras is what I was trying to say right there. Uh, secret Rares, though. Where are you? One, two, three, four. No secrets yet. Milk of the Four Phase Beast. Mask of Restrict. Bazoo the Soul Eater. Four Starred Ladybug of Doom. Guardian Sphinx, Gravity Mind, Creature Swap. We have a Light Force Sword and the Beta, the Magnet Warrior. Still hoping to pull something crazy for those retro packs. We're getting a little bit nervous right here. Another IOC 2017 reprint that I didn't realize I had. I have a couple of them. One, two, three, four. Swap those two. I think I'm right. Yeah, Chop Man, the Desperate Outlaw. Hiya! Very nice. He's chopping. Earth Chant, Ojama Delta, Hyper Hammerhead, Smashing. Boganian, Stealth Bird, we've got a Mad Dog of Darkness, and a Soul Tigre. 
Let's do another champion pack eight. So I think we have three more of them today. We've already pulled an ultra out of one of these packs. That was pretty epic. Let's see if we can do it again. We have World Oppression. That's nice. We have Vanity's Ruler and we have Magician's Valkyria. Okay, Royal Oppression is crazy. I mean, it's good every time. It's worth quite a bit of money, but no foil. That's okay. We already got the Ultra Rare. Legacy of Darkness. I've not given up our hope for a secret rare out of here with Yada or Injection Fairy Lily. Can we do it? 200 pack opening for 200K. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this video. It's been really, really fun. It's definitely a long one. So hopefully your popcorn has been great. Wolf Axel, I know some of you guys are watching this in multiple sessions, like multiple days. You guys always tell me that in the long videos. Heart of Clear Water and hey, an Opticlocks. Okay, just an Opticlocks. Clocks, Opticlocks. <laughs> There's no clocks involved. LON, unlimited, but original. Can we, we already got a bazoo last time. Let's see if we can get, I would love a Gemini Elf. I would love to get Dark Necro here. We already pulled that in a retro pack, so it'd be cool to get it in the ultra rare form here. We have Miracle Dig, Lightning Conger, Zombira the Dark, Boneheimer, the Unfriendly Amazon, Swordsman of Landstar, and a Spirit Message L. So many L's today. That is just not good, son. Back to our last Astro Pack. This is Astro Pack 3. It's another foreign pack that I have. Uh, last time the Maxi did have an Alex Simo inside, but it didn't have anything else. I think last time we didn't need, oh wait, is that a six? No, it's Astro Pack six, not three. It's hard to read these sometimes. Okay, we have uh, Mech Fortress and we got a Super Heavy Samurai. All right, this is probably worth something now. Thanks to all the Super Heavy Samurai stuff coming out. Okay, two more champion pack eight. Let's get these down to one. Here we go. Will there be another foil? Will there be Illumina? We got to believe we have Beckoning Light. Neo Space and Dark Panther and the Necro God. No, just another rare. Okay, no need to fret yet. We have Champion Pack 3 as well. Can we get one of those Spirit, you know, Spirit Reaper is crazy. It's big money. That'd be a nice one. Maybe. I think there's a few good ones in this set. I can't remember what they all are. Oh, no. It's doing the same thing as earlier. It does not want to rip. Why do you not want to rip? There we go. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Let's get it out safely. Let's get that Spirit Reaper out in very nice condition. We have Contract with the Abyss. We have Fairy Dragon, a classic, and Manticore of Darkness. Okay, all right, not bad. Fairy Dragon, actually a pretty cool card. Our last champion pack, two pack. Let's see, this one opened very weirdly last time as well. So I'm hoping that we can open it a little bit easier. And so far it's not working so well. Let's go. Let's get something. Uh, some of these champion packs are not the easiest to open. Two. In the back, here we go. We have Terraforming, we have Twin Headed Behemoth, and the Dark Master Zork. So, in all likelihood, those are probably scaled because they didn't come straight from a box, but still really fun to open some champion packs. We are really getting down to the last few packs here. They're all pretty big hitters at this point. Let's see if Retro Pack, I mean, we've been waiting, we've been waiting, the suspense has been made. Retro Pack, come on, Dark Spirit of the Silent. I believe in you, Barrel Behind the Door, Magic Drain, Bottomless Trap Hole, Creature Swap, Spear message, L, not a good sign, another L. We have a legendary ocean. Gravekeeper spy, will the L bless us with something amazing? No, it's a beta, the magnet warrior. Okay, it's time, turbo pack, it's foreign as well, but turbo pack six, dark arm dragon. This is a very hard set to find. We once opened a hundred packs in a video. You guys can go check that out. I just saw that it is not needed to flip over. You guys can go check out the hundred pack video. It was insane. We had some great pulls. Here we go, we have a creature swap. And there's our rare. Okay, so no Dark Arm Dragon. It's a lot, there's not a lot of suspense with those three pack packs. You either get it or you don't. Last champion pack. Let's just get the three packers out of the way. They've been good. I mean, we got a good pull out of one, which is unusual for opening those. Uh oh, no spoilers. It is an effect monster. That's all we know so far. Effect monster. That could be Lumina. Just saying. Could be Lumina. We have a mushroom man. Good to see you, buddy. Found in human regions. This creature attacks enemies with a lethal rain of poison spores. Watch out for him. Vanity's ruler and Magician's Valkyrie. We got like four of those. We did get a mushroom man, so that's a big plus. Let's open our last Force of the Breaker Unlimited pack. Ryza Ultimate Rare. Let's make it happen. We have hard selling zombie. I think actually this one was. This would be swap, maybe, or is that the rare? Let's just do this. Let's try that. We have Gravity Crush Dragon. We have Wildfire, Volcanic Blaster, Tornado, Introduction to Gallantry, Crystal Blessing. We have a Lucky Iron Axe and a Seismic Crasher. Okay, we need something big. Enemy of Justice First Edition. We need to pull something big, guys. These, these older packs haven't been as good to us as some of the other ones. One, two, three, four. An Ultimate Rare would be huge here. We have Battleful Artemis. Misfortune or an elemental hero of any kind. We have Doom Lord, Guard Dog, O Oversoul, Macrocosmos, pretty crazy common. 
Avalanche Gossa, and a Herald of Green Light. Retro Pack. Retro Pack, we started off really hot out of here, but it has cooled down significantly from Retro Pack. One, two, three, four. We just need a big secret rare, we'll be happy. We have Opticlops, we have Reckless Greed, Book of Dayu, Insect Imitation, Creature Swap, just so many L's, so many L's. It is just not a good sign for this opening. Oh, Yamada Dragon, I didn't know that was the last card. Okay, that was the last card and it was a rare. Now we have our Dark Revelation run. We have three, two, and one, one pack of each. Let's open these up and see what we can get. I don't know any pack trick for these, so I'm just gonna go for it. DR3, we have Skull Dog Marin, sad story, man, sad story. Foxfire, Element Magician, Eagle Eye, Kangaroo Champ, we have Spell Purification, Taunt, Furi Kazan. Necklace of Command, does that mean we didn't get anything? I think it does. Okay, so nothing out of DR3, that's okay. Let's just do all these in a row. Let's do DR2 or DR Volume 2, Dark Revelation Volume 2, whatever you want to call it. It could be right after this tip card. It's not. Mantro Throw, throwing the Ojama Yellow, hilarious. Venus, there are so many cards in the set. 13 cards, yeah, it's the most we have. Unhappy Girl for a little farming and duelings. Gora, Elephant Statue of Blessing, and a Reload, let's go, all right. We did get a Foil Curse Seal as a nice card. We got a super rare out of DR2. Yes, it's been a while since we got a Foil. Very, very nice, we'll take that. And we gotta finish the DR run with DR1. Think Exodia Necros comes in here? This is the one they could have had Dark Magician Girl in and they just didn't. Or no, no, that was, maybe it was this one. Might've been DR2, I don't know. Uh, oh, 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 we got a fear from the dark. Okay, yeah, so those pop up right at the beginning. Nintendogs, let's go, gotta pull that out. We got Marionette, we got D-Tribe, Exhausting Spell, just good stuff, good stuff. We have three Flaming Eternity that I've not opened yet, first edition, so uh, let's pull like an Ultimate Rare, anybody? <laughs> Something like one, I don't know. Could be cool, one, two, three, four, I believe, is it? Firebird, we have Blade Rabbit with those sharp teeth. Hand of Nephthys, DD Dynamite. Abar Yushioni, Flame Ruler, Centrifugal Field, Chusuke the Mouse Fighter, and a Chiron the Mage. That would've been a cool ulti, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, Retro Pack 2. I believe in you, you can do this. You could pull something crazy, okay? Oh, I forgot, we have those four LON First Edition Blisters. We should probably open one of those next. LON First Ed coming up after this. One, two, three, four, after this Blue Eyes Shining Dragon pull. After a word from your Blue Eyes Shining Dragon, here we go, Spirit Message I, Noel, great, it's Chief. We have Goblin Attack Force. Thousand Eyes Idol, Gravekeeper Spy, Book of Moon, Guardian Sphinx, and the final card, Nightmare Wheel. It's a nightmare. It is time to rip up a beautiful blister pack that is in great condition. It is time to ruin that. Oh wait, it's not in great condition, it's open. Okay, perfect. This one is uh, apparently a little open, that's okay. First edition, Labyrinth of Nightmare, let's go. The pack looks like it's in great shape. Feels like it's been preserved pretty well by the blister, which is awesome. First edition LON, one, two, three, four. Secret Rare would be insane out of here. Akibio Drakmorn, Fairy Box, crazy card. Earl of Demise, it's a gentlemanly creature. Soul Purity and Light, Boneheimer, Unfriendly Amazon, Swordsman of Landstar, first edition. That would be an epic one to grade. Bait Doll and the Jalgen, the Spiritualist. All right, for a little final turn or final, final turn? Last turn action, there we go. LOB, Asian English. Give us that blue eyes, baby, for the 200K special. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed the video so far. I want to end it with a crazy pull. I want to, obviously. We'll see if it comes true. Violet Crystal. Let's see blue eyes. Kurama. I'd be happy with Dark Magician or Red Eyes, obviously. We're Exodia. Wasteland. Mystical Sheep. We have Mizurizame. Foils will be awesome. Grotto. Lesser Dragon. Spirit of the Heart, but no, they're done. Come on, Retro Pack 2. You're getting a little bit low at this point. We've opened over half the Retro Pack 2 packs and we have not seen anything in quite a while. Our last one was a Super, I think. There's another Yada. One, two, three, four. We have definitely seen a lot of Yada, which has been great. Tornado Wall, Barrel Behind the Door, Spirit Message Eye, Parasite, Parasite, Yada Garasu, Torrential Tribute, Gravekeeper's Assailant, Gillosaurus, and a Dark Jeroid. Look at that bottom. That thing was cut with a dull blade, that is for sure. Flaming Eternity, first edition, this is your time. This is your time for an epic pull. Let's make something crazy happen. Four from the back, ultimate rare. Let's get the Nephthys. We have March of the Animals, Element Doom, Fulfillment of the Contract, Insect Knight, Majigaya Panda, and the Big Tusk Mammoth. I remember we pulled a Big Tusk Mammoth ultimate rare in our very first every pack opening. That was like one of our best pulls at the end. All right, red, 
label. That means this is an EN pack. EN IOC. So this came in the Force of the Breaker Special Edition, which is pretty cool. Pretty unique for these. Uh, I guess it's three. I'm going to do three. We have Grandmaju de Aiza, Tower of Babel, Giga Gaga Giko, Ojama Yellow, Balloon Lazard, Sacred Crane, Feel the Pain, Curse Seal, Destruction Ring, and a Primal Seed. We also have one Ancient Sanctuary pack. So let's just go ahead and open this. Ancient Sanctuary. Let's see what you can do. Can you bless us with that Dark Magician, whatever it's called, the, you know, uh, the uh, Dark Magic Attack. There we go. The, the White Lightning, AKA Burst Dream of Destruction. Solar Flare, we have Law of the Normal. There's also some other cool cards like Zerato. Solar Ray and, uh, oh, Avatar of the Pot. Watch out for this guy, he's creepy. Let's open another Magic Ruler Unlimited. Will we get? The Blue Eyes Tune Dragon. Let's make it happen. Here we go. One, two, three, four. That would be an epic secret rare pull. We have the Hungry Burger, the burger himself. That's got to be pulled out. Commencement Dance, Metal Fish, the Darth Maul, Awaiting Orders, Giant Turtle, Magical Labyrinth, Dark Zebra, Luminous Spark, and a Karate Man. He's no Hayata. Okay, Labyrinth of Nightmares. This one opened? This one is not open. This one's in better. Oh, wait, no, it is. It's open over here. So these are, uh, they were falling apart. So I guess it was time for me to open these anyway. They're kind of coming open. Labyrinth of Nightmare, first edition. So many great cards. Dark Necrofear. We could pull Gemini Elf. Magic, probably Magic Cylinder out of a Blister is what I would guess. But I've always loved Magic Cylinder, so I'd be super happy with that. Here we go. The Rock Spirit, first set. Give us something cool like an Ultra. Fire Sorcerer, Bio Mage, Spherous Lady, she's Spherous, and she's also beautiful according to the card text. Mario Kutai, The Portrait Secret, and Newbie oh, of the Wicked. Another rare, no! Come on, we gotta pick it up. We gotta pull something crazy here at the end. Retro pack two, all these packs left. We gotta have something inside, right? Gotta believe, one, two, three, four. Believe in the chat, AKA the comments. Melga with the Four Face Beast, Bazoo the Soul Eater. Seen him in Super Rare before. Mask of Restrict, Booga Moon. Kaiku, Premature Burial, we have Call of the Haunted, and an Alpha, we have so many of the Magnet Warrior rares. These Magnet Warriors are painting me, but now we have IOC EN. Let's get a Chaos Emperor Dragon EN or a Blackluster Soldier EN. That'd be pretty cool to go with our recent pull out of IOC First Edition. Blazing Apache, we have Zero Gravity. Chopman, the Desperate Outlaw, Haya. Lot of Chopman appearances, you love to see that. Gigantis, Multiplication of Ants, Terra King Salmon, Recycle. Orca Mega Fortress of Darkness. That snuck up on me. I didn't know that was going to pop up there. That's a nice super. We'll take it. And EN. Mo I was about to say Morka. Orca Mega Fortress of Darkness. LOD. We've been asking for that secret rare. Are you going to bless us? We'll find out. We'll find out right now. One, two, three, four. We have Robotic Knight. Double Snare. Soul Demolition. Convulsion of Nature. Great Long Nose. Short Print. Throw Stone Unit. We're Super Robo Yaru. We have Bark of Dark Ruler, and we have a Suits of Soldier. Back at it again. Here we have an LON Unlimited. So we have a couple first ads left, a couple Unlimiteds left. Let's even get that Gemini Elf in both. Four from the back, Blind Destruction, Scroll of Bewitchment, The Rock Spirit, Flame Dancer. He's got that burning rope. We got the Empress Mantis, Spirit of Flames, Lightning Blade, and Gillosaurus. That's like our fourth scene, like time scene Gillosaurus as well. Retro Pack 2. Hey, Retro Pack 2. You want to have something good inside? Maybe like a Seeker Rare or something? Oh, there's an L. Uh-oh. Lot of L's today. Lot of L's. That is not good. We have a Bazoo, the Soul Eater, again. Reckless Greed, Card of Safe Return. Azura Priest, Spirit Message L. Hate to see that, even though we knew it was coming. Spirit Message in. We have the Kraiku, the Gross Destroyer. Gravity Bind and the Morphing Jar. More rares. That's a lot of rares in a row in a retro pack. All right, Legacy of Darkness. I believe in you. You can do this. Legacy of Darkness. We need a big pull. We haven't had a big pull in a little bit. Four from the back. We have Wolf Axe Butter. I want that secret. Give us the Yada or the Injection Fairy Lily. We have Lizard Soldier. Super Reju. Fushi no Tori. Bad Reaction to Samoji. Robo Lady. And... Oh, I'm freed. The Mattress. The Mattress General? <laughs> The new Mattress General, watch out for Freed. He is on the, oh my goodness, yeah, okay. You know I've been recording for a long time when I say Freed, the Mattress General. All right, let's move on from the Mattress General. I mean, that was funny, but uh, yeah, that was, that was kind of bad. All right, LON, the Mattress General, that's too good. Can we pull something epic? One, two, I, we should make like merch with the Mattress General. We have uh, Lady Panther, but that might, could get a little risque. We have the Echibio Drakmord, Boneheimer. 
Unfriendly Amazon, give us something crazy. Swordsman of Landstar, Bait Doll, can we pull a secret rare? No, but we can pull an ultra card of safe return. All right, back to back big pulls from LON and LOD. Hopefully that's going to heat us up for Retro Pack 2. Oh, and maybe it'll heat up our LOB first dead packs as well. There's our first dead heavy pack right there. Just chilling in the wings, waiting to be opened. Here we go. LOB first dead, Asian English, give us an ultra rare. We have Spike Seedra. Hinotama, follow in, raise body heat, Umi, remove trap. We have Beaver Warrior, classic. We have Yurabi and the Fusionist. The cat with wings spoils us again. Magic Ruler Unlimited. Haven't had anything out of Magic Ruler yet, so I'd be, you know, very happy. Be glad for anything crazy to pop out of here. We have Commencement Dance. Can't, I mean, we've got a burger, that's true. We have Darth Maul, Waiting Orders, Horn of Light. Peacock, Wall Shadow, Stone Ogre Grotto, Chain Energy, and a Giant Rat. Okay, Giant Rat. <sighs> retro Pack 2. We're down to five more Retro Pack 2 packs. Five more. Five more chances at a Secret Rare. Come on. One, two, three, four. It's been a while since we've even pulled a foil out of them. We have Melkid. Spear Message A, better than L. Gemini Elf. We've been looking for that in a different pack, but we've been looking for it. Call the Haunted. Legendary Ocean. Mad Sword Beast. Dark Room of Nightmare, come on, here we go. It's an Insect Queen. My Insect Queen. Weevil Underwood would be very happy. There's a lot of cutting issues at the bottom, but very awesome card. Not a secret, but still Retro Pack 2 Super. We'll take it. Our last Flaming Eternity, then we're all like literally OOG, like the first 10 sets after this. Destroying it completely. Here we go. The Whirlwind Prodigy. One, two, three, four. Will we get an ultimate rare? Golem Sentry, Element Doom, Big March of the Animals, Kangaroo Champ, that's a Ruxin special, Whirlwind Prodigy, Element Burst, Maju Gaia Panda, Arm Samurai Benkai, and a Cross Counter, just a rare. Time for an IOC, this might be a 2010 reprint. It looks kind of like it. Okay, let's find out. One, two, three is what we're gonna do. It really should be more than that, I think. We have Chaos Greed, but if we pull a secret, I won't be mad. Hyper Hammerhead, we have Salvage. Grinmaju Day Aiza, Heart of the Underdog. Be gone, Knave. Thing in the crater, we have Destruction Ring and a Tower of Babel. So nothing in there to really get too crazy about. All right, second to last Magic Ruler pack. We're coming down to the real nitty gritty here. We got some big packs to end it off. We just need one massive hit and then it's a huge success. One, two, three, four. Magic Ruler, come on, Twin Long Rods. No foils yet for Magic Ruler. Mechanical Snail, Guardian of the Throne Room. Boar Soldier, Hamburger Recipe. Psychic Kappa, we got Griggle and a Shining. Angel. Let's go to one of our Labyrinth of Nightmare Blisters, which seem to, this one actually seems to be sealed. This one's a little bit at the bottom, but not as many, not as messed up as the others. First edition, here we go. That could have been from that box. <laughs> Bring in that box like that, here we go. But hopefully that means there's something crazy inside. Magic Cylinder Seeker Rare, come on. We have Amazon Archer, Blind Destruction. We got Scroll of Bewitchment, Rock Spirit, Gross Ghost of Fled Dreams, Lady of Salem of Flames, The Dragonic Attack, Spherous Lady and the Spirit Message in. I thought it was something. It's just an in. At least it wasn't an L. Retro Pack 2. I'm, I'm looking at you. Retro Pack 2. I'm expecting you to step it up. I'm waiting on you. You did get a super last time. That's something. It's a good start, but the secret, not the super is what we want. We have an eye. I think we've pulled all of them now. Barrel. Tornado Wall. We got an A. Same pack. We have a Legendary Ocean. Mad Sword Beast. Dark Room of Nightmare. Spear Dragon. And you free the Iron Knight. All right, I think now is the time for a little Portuguese Metal Raiders. Pequeno Moth potential. I mean, we've been needing a big pull, so why not pull the Pequeno Moth, right? Am I right? Yeah, let's do it. There's the Pumpkin right at the front. One, two, three, four. We have Juragumo, Golem Destructior, Drago of Flames. We have Prevent Rat, the uh, Pumpkin Game of Ghosts, Paralyzing Potion, Insect Soldiers of the Sky. We have Insect Spider or something like that. And, okay, not even the Pecanio Moth. Rarest card in Yu-Gi-Oh, though. Let's open our Pharaonic Guardian pack, which we have had. This is unlimited, crazy commons here. You guys know this if you've watched my videos. Pharaonic Guardian has a lot of crazy cards. One, two, three, four. Poison Mummy, Call of the Mummy, Impachi, Shape Snatch, Needle Wall, Gravekeeper, Spear Soldier, Reasoning, Master Kionchi, and a King Tiger Wangu, actually a pretty good card there. Only three Retro Pack 2s left. It's coming down to the wire, everybody. Three left, we've opened 21. Still no secret, one, two, three, four. You guys remember the 100K special? We pulled no secret rares out of Retro Pack 2. 
might happen at 200k as well. Reckless Greed, we have Gemini Elf, a Legendary Ocean, Mad Sword Beast. Come on, Retro Pack 2, Dark Room and Nightmare, Spear Dragon, let's go. Oh, our Beast Bad Dragon! We did it! A secret rare! It has happened in the, what, fourth, the last, third, the last Retro Pack 2? Oh my goodness! Secret Rare has been pulled! The voice is going away! Centering looks awesome on it! Oh my goodness! Harpy's Pet Dragon is one of the three I mentioned. I mean, Blue Eyes Shining is obviously the one we really want, but this or uh, the Dragon Master Knight are both insane. All right, guys, let's take a moment to appreciate this card. Secret Rare Retro Pack 2, Harpy's Pet Dragon. Oh, yes, we did it. Secret Rare has been pulled from Retro Pack 2. All right, it is time for our final Legend of Blue Eyes by Dragon Asian English. I'm literally losing my voice mid-video. <laughs> Here we go. One, two, three, four. Wait, that was five. That was five. Don't do that. We have the 13th grade. Maybe that means it was a foil. It's a little sticky. Skull Servant. We have Silver Fang. I did the pack trick. I did the pack trick. There's no pack trick. All right, Dragonist. That's, a, that's the same card we did the pack trick with in the other video. Crazy. Kind of weird how that works out. I can't complain now that we've pulled that awesome, uh, you know, Retro Pack 2 card. Let's open a Magic Ruler because this is unlimited. I'm going to open all the unlimited couple packs we have left. And then we'll open our first sets to end it off. Wavy LB pack coming up. This is weighed heavy, by the way. So it should have a foil in it. Sometimes it can be wrong, but it seems like it has a foil inside. Horn of Light. It's one of the heaviest packs I have. Sonic Bird. We have Tyone number two. Electric Snake. My voice is killing me. Crab Turtle. <laughs> Snake Fang. We got a Peacock. Who's going to watch The Office? We have Wall Shadow. Never belong. Magic Ruler. Duds today. Speaking of Unlimited, we got Metal Raiders. Let's do Metal Raiders. Let's get that Petit Moth original print let's make it happen okay i can't believe i did the pack trick on asian english i forgot we have labyrinth trap tank trap okay mortal of thunder mega thunderball surprise we haven't put a foil to the front yet lava battle guard mornfin pump king the king of ghosts crash clown and which is like for us just like the portuguese pack okay guys magician's force we only have one pack today it's unlimited we have pulled Dark Magician Girl twice this year. Can we pull it a third time? One, two, three, four. I mean, that would be pretty insane. Old Vindictive Magician. We got a Mass Driver. I don't mind my voice hurting a little bit if we pull that. Thunder of Ruler. Magical Marionite. Marionette. Marionite. What am I talking about? Pixie Knight. And... Uh, Anti. Little Anti. Giving up his Summon Skull? Why would you do that? Summon Skull? Skull Server? What am I saying? I'm catching myself before the edits. And the comments would have been gone crazy if I had not mentioned that that was Skull Servant. Our last unlimited pack of the opening. An original unlimited blue eyes white dragon pack we have basic insect original print lob rain Timatura, book of secret arts fire yaru mountain mystical moon dark king of the abyss and oh wait one more fiend reflection number two and a mystical elf yes we got a mystical elf does this have like damage to it wait look at that it's like a little, it has like a, either a print line or it's bent. I can't tell. It might be a giant print line. It's like two of them. You guys see that? That looks insane. Is this like, why does this card almost look glossy? I think it's a, it shouldn't be glossy, but I don't think it is. It just kind of appeared to be glossy, but it has that nice, like older looking, like darkness to it. I always love the look of Mystical Elf. That is a beautiful super rare. What? That's a nice way to end the unlimited packs. Okay, let's do one more retro pack too. Back-to-back -to -back secrets, anybody? I mean, how crazy would that be? Like after starting off no secrets for so long, just getting two in a row. I mean, at this point, I'm super happy with the secret rare. That's like pretty amazing. I've never pulled that one. Goblin Attack Force. And it's one of the like probably top three or four. Dust Tornado. That's a Ruxin special. We've only had like two today, like 200 packs. Not bad. Book of Moon, Dark Room of Nightmare, Skull Invitation, Torrential Tribute, and the Revival Jam. All right, reviving the jam. Okay, guys, we are down to the final five packs of our 200 pack opening. There's some insane stuff left, including this. Let's go. Let's just finish this thing off. I don't even know why I needed to like say that, but I just feel like fi final five, you know, it's such a long video. We, you made it to the last part. Like, if you didn't skip to the end at this point, you are insane and you're a legend. Thank you so much for watching the whole video. I really appreciate it. Let's once again shout out Sassiato for absolutely being awesome and sponsoring my 200k specials. And thank you, you guys for subscribing. It's been awesome. Drag Manipulator. Let's see if we can pull something crazy to end it just for you guys. Legendary Ocean, Ominous Fortune Telling, Mysterious Guard. We have Stamping Destruction, Spring of Rebirth, and After Genocide. That is pre-errata first edition just a rare though 
Let's open our last Labyrinth of Nightmare blister, which is, I, I didn't even notice, but these are like already open. So hopefully that means they were not messed with. I doubt it, but they probably just fell open. It happens with blisters. You got to be careful. And especially when like shipping them, they get, you know, bounced all over the place. That's usually when that would happen, like the glue would loosen up. So it kind of makes sense that on their way here that happened. But I was going to open them anyway, so who cares? One, two, three, four. Can we get a secret rare out of Labyrinth of the Nightmare? That would be so cool. Ultra rare would be great as well. Spirit Elimination, Skull Lair. We have Hysteric Fairy, Cyclone Laser, the Dream Sprite. Humanoid Worm Drake, this is a short print. That's actually a crazy card. Grave Robbers Retribution, we have a Gadget Soldier, and here we go! Fire Princess, and it's actually pretty centered. Okay, it's a super rare, we'll take that. Foil in our last LON First Dead Blister. So it looks like these were not messed with. Very nice. The final three packs, we have Invasion of Chaos. I'll save a retro pack because we want that blue eyes shiny dragon. First edition Invasion Chaos. We opened a box the other day. Go check it out for the beginning of the 200K subscriber special. It was pretty awesome. Let's see if we can follow that up with something crazy out of a single pack that I bought. Let's go. I've had this one for a while. One, two, three, four. Let's see if it was worth holding on to. Amphibious Bugroth MK3. We have Ryu Koki, Gale Lazard, Didi Borderline, Yellow Luster Shield, Burning Algae, Ojama Black, Blasting the Ruins. Can we get that Chaos Emperor Dragon? No, but we can get a Stray Lambs. Retro Pack 2, our last pack today. I still have more from that purchase, but you know, we, we picked the right ones, I guess, with the Secret Rare. Last pack today. Can we get one more foil out of here? One, two, three, four. Let's do this. They're kind of sticking together. Noble and Macross out. We have Parasite, Parasite, Gemini Elf, Card to Save Return, Thousand Eyes Idol, Call of the Haunted, Insect Imitation, Creature Swap, and a Hell Bomber! Hellbomber, however you say it. Ultra Rare. That's like our third Ultra Rare out of Retro Pack. It's been a good Retro Pack 2 opening today. And it all comes down to this, the most nerve-wracking of all the packs. This is a heavy, wavy first edition Legend of Blue Eyes pack. My palms are a little sweaty. We don't want to get anything on the cards. Getting a little nervous because this is this is the one that could contain the Legend of Blue Eyes, Blue Eyes White Dragon first edition wavy print. So yeah, it's big. Here we go. Send me luck, guys. One of my heaviest packs I have because I did get all those packs and we got some weights from them. And this is one of the heaviest. So I'm hoping that that means there's a Blue Eyes inside. One, two, three, four. Gotta be careful. We have... Electro Whiff, first edition LOB, beautiful looking cards. King Fog, we are still recording. Beaver Warrior, a Beaver Warrior first dead, awesome. Petite Dragon, not the Petite Moth, Karama, give us something crazy. Terra, the terrible, he's pretty terrible. Speaking of terrible, let's get a blue eyes, not terrible. Dark Gray, Turtle Tigre, how many cards is that? That's seven, I think. I think it's the next card. This could be the moment I've been searching for for many years. The Blue Eyes White Dragon, here we go. No, but it is a polymerization. All right, that's a beautiful super rare. We'll take it. I'm not disappointed because it is a foil and it's one of the best super rares you can get. Polymerization, that is an awesome way to end this 200K subscriber special. If you guys have enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more epic content. Maybe not just like this, but should be some cool stuff coming up. Shout out to Tone Fo Show, Daxer, JT Cho, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanna, Dizzy, Mycycle, America Deutster, Supreme Stage 21, and then a tie show, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Mehmet Gecko, and Thomas McLean. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.